April Fools! To me! Ah! Please don't copyright strike me, Nickelodeon. I swear it was out of love. So, uh, yeah. I made a thing. If we go to the correct scene anyway. And there are rules. So basically, here's how today's stream gonna go down. If we miss any shots, the stream's immediately extended by 15 minutes. So we're gonna go with the typical two hour stream. If we miss, say, four shots, then it's a three hour stream. Non vital hits means I gotta do yeah, back in my day for three minutes. Oh, good, the rules are gone already. Hang on, come back. No organs hit, meaning just a flesh hit. That will mean we gotta use no sights for the next shot, which will only cause chaos. And if we shoot any female animal, we. <laughs> I just saw, not playing Big Game Hunter, if we do any female animal as a shot, if we hit it, doesn't matter if we kill it or not, all three of the things above will trigger. So this should be fun. I'm looking forward to this. I guess my April Fool's aspect is the fact that I'm streaming early, but I thought there's a chance we miss a bunch of shots, and therefore this could be a long stream. Might as well get it going. Rearview Lad, thank you for becoming a shoes to you. Welcome, welcome. Good to have you here. What's up, Bree? So what you're saying is we need to cause a 24-hour stream. I mean, it could happen. It certainly could happen. The current time is about 10 a.m. We're gonna do some grizzly bear hunting, but we're just gonna start with this and, and kinda go. I don't even know, I think I have the April Fool's, sorry, uh, Easter weapons still. It is April Fool's, so close enough, I suppose. Yeah, uh, check out Kyla's non-tip in Discord from, from the Hunter Classic. Those of you that played it, it's in my Classic chat. She has once again bested me in Classic. <laughs> Sitting back for the next 12 hours? Hey, it could be. We shall see. What if you find a female rare? Well, I suppose it depends how badly I want to shoot it. It could be a matter of, uh, you know, what would you say, piebald cow moose that we shoot all the time? Maybe I ignore it? Maybe it should just be a requirement that I have to shoot a female rare and all of those rules will happen. I'll put the rules up periodically throughout the stream as well. I do have little stream extension and old man voice timers which for whatever reason that one there it is that's supposed to be the three minutes so should have everything on screen when stuff happens it should be easy to understand what's up kflow yeah uh april fools i got you you bet you weren't ready for that <laughs> what's going on Leanne? uh us arc fans are waiting for the arc ascended map to drop is it are they actually dropping on april fools that's an interesting move Female rare red fox? If I find that, yeah, I mean, we're just accepting all of the consequences, I guess. Is that right, ZBG? I also found out that Justin Jefferson's getting traded to the Steelers. I don't know how that works, but, um, <laughs> seems there's certain things that are said on this day that are not true. Can you believe it? Uh, Jakey, thank you for subscribing, by the way. Started off April Fool's with a troll moose and mallard. Wow. <laughs> That's just not kind. What's going on, Joe? What's up, Jets? Just killed a fabled silver, typical 272 fallow. Sucks because I got a 274. Uh, oh, you, you have one that's just two points bigger? What the heck? What are the odds of that? Is that is that the game April Fool's in you as well? What are you barking at? Not even see anything going on. All right. Let's go to... I feel like wolf territory is a good idea. That will likely cause chaos. What map do you want to come next? I mean, I still want a Greenland map, but I don't know how likely it is that actually happens. Uh, your Diamond Tiger Fish from Early Access would be the community record if it counted towards it. It would be the longest standing record. It's only by like, what, 0 0.06 or something? I just checked the other day. I figure eventually it's going to get bested, but it is kind of cool, like whether it truly counts or not. It is kind of cool that, especially as someone who literally doesn't catch diamonds ever in the game, <laughs> getting to have a record for a while. I, I've uh, heard a couple people call it like Flinter Spot or whatever. I'm like, wow, I have an impact on the game finally. My April Fools was yesterday. All level three white tails were trolls. How many did you shoot? Bottom boy, thank you for the 42 months, by the way. I'm guessing that's not going to come up because YouTube is rude. I don't know why we're lagging today. Now, strange. Anyway, couldn't pay my mortgages on the first because my membership renewed. Hashtag priorities. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't make me think about that. On the day where females are off limits, Flincher will find an albino female grizzly. Oh, I'd have to shoot that too. Would just simply have to shoot it. Think it be, should be the other way around? On, uh, what's that again? Houses are temporary, Flantro is eternal. I, I've been talking about, this is like so off topic. I've been talking about, um, 
when GTA 6 is like officially coming out, when we're getting kind of close-ish to it. What can I turn down here? Maybe that for now. Um, I'm gonna stream GTA 5 over on Twitch, just like sort of like we did with Subnautica before Below, Below Zero came out and all that kind of stuff. And I realized I should call it Los Flantros for the city. Anyway, Danny, thank you for the 44 months. Welcome back. Just finished watching your Double Wildebeest video, and I'm so jealous. That was pretty cool. Like, literally, I said I want a Bighorns one. Go over the hill, and there's a Bighorns one. So, I, oh, I don't even have a good gun for this. I gotta think about things when I'm going for these shots. If we hit them in the non-vital, I gotta go for the, uh, the Flantro voice. And I almost just shot that female, because it's standing there, but that's also supposed to not happen. I've got the... What is this? The M1? I didn't say anything about using the wrong weapon. I don't know if I can get... <laughs> I'm nervous to get my- oh no. <laughs> he moved. Oh, was that vital? I'd have been vital, we might be okay. April Fools, my wife pays our mortgage, there you go. <laughs> Caught, the Caught my first live stream, welcome on in, man. Hope you have a good time, it should be interesting with all the stuff we got going on. I'll throw the, uh, the rules of today's sort of challenge stream up on screen there real quick. So you can see what we're working with. That paint job is atrocious. I'll switch weapons. Okay, we got vitals, so we're okay. Our first shot has not caused us to have anything crazy going on. I tried running OBS as uh, administrator today, thinking it would cut down on stream lag, but since the game's lagging, it seems to cause problems anyway. Your buffalo's at the end. I swear you killed the seven, but you never found it? You know, I never looked that close to see what happened. I kind of just assumed I missed because I didn't find blood, but who knows? The other day I got two level 5 little beasts standing next to each other and one of them was a 39, not bad. Definitely Bighorns. I don't know where Bighorns starts. It might be at 39. Whew. <laughs> Pretty lucky. Through the top of the lungs and the vertebrae. So, why don't we go and um, get better weapons that don't look like that. Wrong gun should be 10 minutes longer. Well, I thought about that, but other than in that case where I just don't have a legal weapon. That probably would just never happen unless I did it on purpose. And it feels like that's a bad thing to do is mess stuff up on purpose. Then again, if we find a female, we shall see. Uh, let's see, or a female rare even. Oh, I just thought of something. So on the rules, I put does are illegal today. But literally any female is how I wrote the rule out. So when a pack of wolves comes after us, I really gotta be careful. <laughs> this is gonna be a lot of fun. I didn't really think through all this super, um, you know, in a lot of detail. So who knows how this may go. Is the... No, it's three. So we need 243 and 22. Nope. What am I carrying that I don't need? Now 22. Stuart, thank you for subscribing, by the way. Appreciate you. Welcome, welcome. I should have... I actually wasn't gonna stream early today, by the way. I was attempting to record for the Classic event. That's going to be tomorrow's video. There's an April Fool's event going on in Classic. Couldn't really find any of the things, so I just figured, what the heck, <laughs> we're going to fire up the stream, and I'm a little less than prepared. Nice, JCT. That was, I think mine was the size 5 popper, but either way, same difference. It's cool to catch one when you're completely not expecting it like that. Got my first piebald bison last night, a gold one. Nice. Plains bison or Euro bison? 30 on 6, and 300. Unsure if it's a good or bad thing to not have a semi-automatic. Any DLC recommendations for... I'm assuming beginners? Oh, I, I think, yeah. I have Modern Rifle and Bloodhound. You're in pretty good shape with, with Modern Rifle, to be honest. Yeah, because the, the weapons that are ethical for class 9, your modern rifle is going to go only up to class 8. You still have to unlock the ammo anyway. The 7 mil, if you've unlocked that already through the base game, or the 338, will be good for the larger animals in the game. I don't think there's anything else I'd immediately go out and purchase. I think you're, you've actually made the right uh, choices. What's the classic event? See, I don't know if I want to like spoil what it is, because they made a point of not spoiling what it is. If you want to know what it is, go on my Discord and look in the classic chat. I'll, I'll put it that way. For those that don't want it spoiled yet, if you want to like, you know, get home from work or school today and, and go and find it for yourselves, I won't spoil it. Eurobison, nice, Jamie. J 
Just bought Mississippi today, double diamond teal in the same flock and a diamond quail. Goodness gracious, th those are some of the more rare ones, especially the diamond quail. Congrats. Got a 190 uh, albino fallow on Hirsch. Dude, that's awesome. Hirsch rares just have a little extra aura about them. Uh, Kelsey, thank you for the super chat. Very much appreciate the uh, support. Thank you so much. What are your least favorite maps? You know what's funny? Like, I had a general sort of hatred. Not hatred's a strong word, but you know what I mean. Uh, for Mississippi and New England. In the last, uh, but what would you say? Maybe, I'm going to change it to Grizzly time. In the last, like, six months, year, I've kind of gained an appreciation for how difficult they are to hunt and, like, being able to succeed while hunting them. Let me look at the map. Because now that it's grizzly time, we should be able to find them. We, last week, spent time getting them in their day zone. So hopefully we're going to be able to do that. What would be my least favorites? Like, it's unfair to Te Aoroa that it's one of my least favorites. But the fallow grind just, I, I have no interest in going back because I spent so much time there. Kind of same with Quattro and the Red Deer grind. It's not that I don't like the maps. It's just that I, I sort of burnt myself out on them. What's your favorite animal hunt in Call of the Wild? Hopefully we get to hunt some of them today. I love when we get aggressive packs to Grey Wolves. Now, with today's challenges and the rules, and I'll, I'll throw them up on screen again since I'm talking about them, that bottom one there, that's... Does are illegal, but we're going with any female animal. That's how I wrote it out. If a pack of wolves attack, attacks us, I gotta, like, spot what we're shooting and try not to shoot females, because we'll make it stack. Let's say I forget that we're doing this and kill three females, then it's going to be like 45 minutes extended on the stream. I got to do Flantro Grandpa voice for nine minutes. It'll be a whole thing. I shouldn't shoot fleeing animals, but like, where's the point in that? Got to make it interesting. What if I shoot the ground, though? <laughs> That'll be close. We'll see. Got a vital. Two for two. What gun did you use to kill your what now? Four missed shots equals an hour? Exactly. I never, you know, I don't count when I miss shoots, shoots, shots during a regular stream. I don't know how many shots I tend to miss during a two hour stream. I have no idea what to expect for this. I use the lake near you for hunting grizzly? The, uh, the wolf's head lake or this one? I don't know if they drink at the wolf's head lake. We gotta go up north, too. There's a bunch of zones up there. Just finished my collection of gold of every gator and croc. Never mind, I don't have a light brown. You have a... For other than light brown, you have a rare of all those different variants? That's amazing. What map has grizzly bears? Just Yukon Valley. Only map in the game with grizzlies. There are brown bears on Medved Taiga and Reventuli Coast. There are black bears on Leighton Lakes... Mississippi Acres, Silver Ridge Peaks, New England Mountains. They should put black bears on this map too. I would love a map with multiple bear species. And this is the perfect place. Like Yukon Valley should have, in my opinion, black bear and grizzly. All right, new plan. We're going where the grizzlies are, whether they like it or not. What is your favorite map? I really like Leighton Lakes. I almost did this stream on Leighton Lakes but I kind of thought it'd be more fun to go after some other species. Things that, you know, most stuff on Leighton, whether it's whitetail, blacktail, even, you know, elk and bears and stuff, is not huge animals. Grizzly, moose, bison, the, these things on this map, I think it's more likely that we mess up some shots and make this uh, a little more interesting. What's going on, Mel? Would you like to join me in crying about Kyla having a giant knot tip in Classic? Watch you on a coach bus on my way to New York for a school trip. Oh, nice, man. Hopefully it'll make the trip a little bit faster for you. What's going on, Gunhub? Zyplobe, I don't know if I said that even close to correct. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome, welcome. If anyone's ever gotten all five species of great ones in a year or less, I would bet. It's probably been done. What new animal do you want to call the wild? Well, while we're on Yukon Valley, I've always wanted dull sheep on this map. I think they could fit. I think you could actually do them up in this northern region where it's pretty mountainous and it would be reasonable to have them here. Like, just imagine a rare 
ish population of doll sheep. Like, uh... Maybe how, how frequently you see... Like, bobcats on New England? Something like that? You only see, you know, a group of them every now and then kind of thing? I just, it would be so neat to like come up over a hill and there's a couple of doll sheep standing there up on the, the hillside. And back, in your opinion, is a hot office or cold office worse? Hot is worse. Because once, like, a cold office, if you have a blanket or you turn the heat on or a hoodie or whatever, you can kind of, you know, get through that. I'm really risking things. <laughs> uh, if it's hot, you're just kind of stuck. I mean, like... If you got an AC or whatever. But, you know, it's it's more miserable in my opinion. How'd your Easter go? Uh, pretty good. We, we went over to my parents for the entire day. Had, uh, definitely ate way too much. But my dad, I think for like three or four years, my mom and dad have had a tradition of like doing a, I guess like a Easter egg hunt for adults. And by that I mean actually really hard to find. Like, there were, I think there's six of us. So it's like, Myself, my two siblings, and then our, uh, the three of our significant others. So, there were 30 eggs, which means everybody got to find five. And it took, I don't know, close to an hour? Dad's really good at hiding them. Like, there, he found divots in the yard from where deer ran through and really pushed the ground down a little bit. Had a couple of eggs in there and then covered them with leaves and stuff. And I realized that might not sound really well hidden. But they were the last two they were found that were found. He he just makes it really tough, but it's fun. We had a good time. Do classic Mel. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Your parents sound great, and the actual Easter egg hunt sounds fun. I think they got it figured out to be honest. I, I've I uh, sometime in the last year or two I kinda thought about that. They've just like At least best I can tell. Their favorite thing is to have like everybody over, you know, cook a big meal like Feeding all of us is like their their thing, which I think is pretty normal for all parents. And then I I've said it on streams before, our like family motto or whatever is like food, family, beer, football, and hunting. <laughs> Everything revolves around that. What is your favorite grind? Um, favorite grind we've ever done at least. Hello there. Probably. Like, the whitetail was, was the coolest one, in my opinion. Not because we got it the fastest, though that certainly helps. The biggest thing about the, the whitetail grind was everything was so unknown. Now, to a degree, when you're doing a grind, like, you kind of know, like, all right, eventually this is going to happen. Like, if I shoot enough of these things, if I, you know, leave small ones or whatever, I'm going to get a great one eventually. When we did the whitetail grind, everything was purely speculative like it was a group effort like people in chat were like hey what if we try this what if we you know what happens if you do this we would just try stuff it was cool what's going on Sue? april fools we don't have a sourdough starter ha <laughs> got him <laughs> how much time do you add on per miss so how do i have this a miss shot is 15 minutes let me put the rules up again Miss shot is 15 minutes. Non-vital, I gotta do three minutes of hey, back in my day. I was gonna do five minutes, but I realized two things. One, people that haven't been in the stream yet and come in and hear me doing that are gonna be like, why is he still doing Like, why is he just talking like this nonstop? And then two, I think that's gonna strain my voice if I do it for a long time, which is kind of why it's a bit of a, I think a decent, like, addition to the challenge. And then, no organs hit, meaning like a flesh hit. That is going to be... I have it set up so it goes away automatically. Uh, no sights for the next shot, which just makes it more likely that we miss or something again. No worries, Uncle Nate. Uh, why does your character throw the magazine in the air when reloading? Does he do it with the... See, I was going to shoot into the air, but does that count as a miss? Does he do it with the 300? I know he does it with the 338. So what that is, I'm about to try a 400 meter shot and set things into motion here. Where's his head? Go drink. I'll come back to that, I promise. Drink. What are you doing? He didn't drink. <laughs> I don't know, did that get along? Uh-oh. It has begun. Alright, we'll have to see 
what happened, but I'm pretty sure that's just going to be a flesh hit. So what was I answering? I said I was going to come back to that, and I forget what I was... It was... Oh, the throw in the magazine thing. So, you get different animations with, um... Under perks, handguns, this one at the top right, lightning hands, it decreases your reload time. I think it's only with tier 3 you get some of the fancy animations. That's what's causing it. Fool's errand begins, indeed. Unless it was like the lowest death time for a long shot I've ever seen. But I want to make sure, like, it was a off to the side shot, so it could have been non-vital. If you get a hard shot, you should have to just say moist on repeat for 12 seconds to prank us? No. You should have to say moist. Have you heard of the boss in Canada? Big Isn't Soup the boss in Canada? You have a rare female fox and a nine legendary at the same zone? What? Which one are you going to shoot first? Because I don't even know what I would do. Better start thinking about that 24-hour stream? Well, I didn't miss. So this one doesn't extend the stream yet. It just makes things potentially more chaotic because I'm going to have no sights. I'm also not going to allow myself to be like, all right, no sights, 10 meters. <laughs> We're going to, I don't know, 100, 150, whatever's, whatever's going on. You're the supervisor of Canada planning a coup on our prime minister? Oh, good. <laughs> I'm glad I read that out loud. Uh, next map prediction, and what do you want? I want a Greenland map. I want, like, an Arctic Medved-like, but with deeper snow and stuff. Musk ox, Arctic wolves, Arctic fox, snowshoe hare, caribou, the whole thing. Uh, next map prediction? I, I honestly don't even know. Like, we were talking about this in a recent stream. Jaxie says, like, we're getting those. That's kind of, I, I don't know if that's a hint, but that was his reaction. So people have been speculating based on that. I don't know what kind of thing would be so crazy for him to say, like, we're getting those? Like, what's the, what's the craziest thing you can think of that we don't already have in the game? And I kind of, I don't have an answer for that. Now, I know we didn't miss. Where was he standing? There's blood. All right. No organ sin. Put it up one more time so everybody knows what's going on. That means I got to use no sides for the next shot, which could send things into interesting positions. Especially if we got to shoot far at a grizzly. That's not good pizza. Asia or Africa? We've been told it's not going to be Africa. Which, unless they were, you know, April foolsing us eight months in advance. He told us that a long time ago? I think he's talking about primates? Are any primates something? That's, it's, uh... That gets dangerously close to a line there, I feel like. I guess, like, baboons and stuff are, huh? Got a piebald croc? Nice. What's going on, Tyler? Stop eating mountains of beans and your stomach won't bother you. <laughs> it's just, you know, it's like a, like a salmon that swims up ripper. It's just in its nature. Imagine hunting gorillas. I don't, I don't think I would like that. Like if they added them for some weird reason, I would probably have to shoot one because I want to get a diamond of one. But I don't think that would be something I'd actively want to go and hunt again. You know what I mean? Six piebald fallow and eight diamonds in my grind. Not too bad. Sounds like you're off to a good start. Where are the grizzle bears? There should be more here. Oh, it was... Huh. Maybe we deleted that zone? It was over here in this corner last time. We had like a whole bunch. All stacked into one spot. And I see nothing. Well... I guess we can go no sights on a caribou that's 300 meters away. I don't know how I'm going to possibly hit that, but we'll try. Could have met seals. Maybe. Would that be an Arctic kind of map? I, I actually don't know enough about seals. It, yeah, that's Arctic-ish, right? I'm going to save it for the video, Corndog. Um, I did attempt to record... Uh, for the event to make a video uh, that was meant to come out tomorrow 
and I'm gonna go back to it later, but I haven't found a single one of the event animals. Alright, so what do I even have? I have the 30-odd-6. Oh my. <laughs> if this hits, I'll be amazed. Might be where the stream gets extended. Oh, hit him. No extension yet. No way. Uh, I don't know, that feels vertebrae-ish to me. What does vertebrae count as? Like, what does the blood say? It's non-vital, right? You want three minutes of gramps? Hey, back in my day, kids your age had some respect and I didn't ask for handouts. Non-vital? <laughs> What's up, Warcup? Vertebrae's non-vital? I, I'm not sure yet. It might have been that it was a long distance shot. We'll see, but could have been something like that. Guess I can put my scope back on anyway. We didn't miss. You're a vertebrae? No, you're. Let's get the 2061. I, I guess I'm dumb. 2061? That spelling goes hard. Good, good job. You did it. What diamond should I go after next? I mean, well, you just shot a caribou. They're kind of interesting to go after. How about caribou? What's the rarity on diamond largemouth? I don't think they're any more or less rare than any other diamond. That was vital. No way. Want a stream of Old Man Flantro and Granddad Beagle arguing about the Great Depression? Had, well, I don't know if it would have been Great Depression, but had I come up with the idea more recently than, like, 7 p.m. last night, I was actually going to message Beagle and be like, hey, do you want to help me, like, do an April Fool's thing where we just be old people impressions? Caribou troll so much? They do. Them and reindeer are... They may be second only to kangaroos, because kangaroos are pretty terrible trolls. That was pretty close, I don't know. I guess we'll honor the rules. That was really close to just being uh, not what we wanted. Joshua, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Just realized I've been subscribed since 2018. That is quite something. You know what? It's freaky 2018, I think, like, oh, wow, year and a half or something like that. No, it's been six years. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. Imagine a caribou great one. So that was... When I, I haven't had the, like, I guess opportunity or whatever to fully flesh out the Greenland map idea I talked about a little bit ago, but when I brought it up on stream, Great One Caribou was my idea, because I think caribou are in that class of animals, older models here in the Hunter Call of the Wild, that need a remodel, like what they did with moose when they got their great ones, or black bear, or red deer got a little bit of one, fallow deer got a major one. Caribou could use an overhaul. So give us Great One Caribou, that's your excuse to overhaul them. Make them way bigger. Do you know how many more people would hunt Yukon? It'd be a huge number. Oh, just messed up a gold albino gray fox, that, that's so unfortunate. Hopefully you get another chance at one. Hopefully, They're, I will say they are rare, but you never know. What's going on, Hatcha? ZBG since 2019? That's, that's, again, like I feel like, wow, last year, no. <laughs> Five years. I appreciate it, man. Appreciate you sticking around. Good lord, pizza. Oh, I don't know if I can pronounce that. Christelle? Is that close? Hopefully I got that correct. Thank you for becoming a shoosty. That alert should come up in a second, but I wanted to get that read before it comes off the chat. Very much appreciate the support. If you're not in the Discord, be sure to join that as well. Link up your YouTube to the Discord. Get the member roll. Take advantage of that good stuff and enjoy the green name and emojis in chat. What are you barking at? Reindeer and caribou need better antlers? I don't know if enough about reindeer personally to be able to say like for sure they do, but caribou, 100%. Like, do some caribou racks look like the diamond caribou we have in the game? Yes. Um, but if you look at trophy caribou in real life, there's such variety in the antlers, and the diamond ones in Call of the Wild are, are pretty similar from one to the next. There's the uh, alert. Crystal, thank you again for becoming a member. I saw, got 100% correct. Happy about that. I tried to get him anyway. 
I feel bad if I say people's names wrong. The caribou in Greenland and the caribou in Caldwell are so different when it comes to antlers, they need more width, width and definition. Width is a big thing I think they need, like variety and width. And just like, the classic reindeer kind of have what I want. Like more diversity in the tops of the antlers and stuff or variety. This would be really nice. Subscribe when I watch your albino diamond moose video. That remains one of my favorites ever. I was, what was I doing? Oh, the uh, April Fool's challenge. No, the Easter challenge. See, I'm getting myself confused. They're a day apart. Who made the calendar this year? Anyway, I was running around Leighton, which by the way, I don't think I killed a single thing on Leighton because I couldn't find, what was I even looking for? Oh, I couldn't get a iron sight shot at anything. I couldn't find a place to get a hundred meter iron sight. So I went to SRP, but I was just like imagining, you know, coming around a corner and there's a big albino moose like that time. Just, I'd love to re-experience that again. It was so cool. I don't know where all of our grizzly bears are, but they're like not existing. You made the calendar? You fool. April fool. Is there an April Fool's event? Not in Call of the Wild, I don't think. I, di I didn't see anything, you know, like no weapon skins, no nothing. I wonder, there may be, um, Easter colors. Yeah, I knew I read something that came up in the Hunt Club beta, but it's just Easter stuff. I guess nothing at all. There is one in Classic. Call of the Wild doesn't do a lot of events, and I'm actually not quite sure why. It seems like a good thing to do, but for whatever reason, that's not been kind of their MO. Got my first diamond croc in light brown after that, and I got the great one red deer. Nice. I'm so jealous of the light brown croc that they look amazing. The eye on my keyboard is being stupid. There's no eye in stupid, but there is a U. I hope you get what I'm saying. Uh, how do I become a member? It's on the uh, super chat button, I believe. Love the idea. Miss a shot longer stream. We haven't missed yet. Um, we did have a no organs hit, which meant I had to do no sights on the next shot, but we hit a 300 meter liver shot on a caribou, so we didn't have to add anything to it. The idea behind that one is just that in all likelihood, going open sights, it just it's way more likely we miss or end up with a non-vital hit the next time. Haven't clipped any females yet either. She's laying underneath your blanket. How long extra do you gotta go if you miss a shot? 15 minutes. Here, I'll put the things up again. It was supposed to fade in. I don't know how I screwed that up that it just pops up, but it's okay. It fades out. Good job, Sue. Okay. If there's no grizzlies at these legs, I'm gonna assume something happened. Cause like, there should be grizzlies here. Needs to be an elk great one that totally agree. <laughs> if I was doing these challenges, I'd be streaming for three hours already. I wouldn't say I've been careful. I've been shooting some stuff on the run, but I've maybe tried not to just start firing, firing willy nilly. I feel like it is unfair to the whole challenge of this for me to just not shoot anything unless it's a perfect spot. So I'm trying to make sure that we go for tough shots. Hope they add rock ptarmigan with winter plumage. Seems like a, like one of those little detail things that'd be nice if they added it. No. Why you spook? We finally found one. They hate us. So how's the Minecraft buck working classic? Honestly, I don't know. I haven't gotten one yet. Kyla got one of those and a 363 non-typical whitetail because that's, she plays classic like basically April Fool's and Halloween and kills insane stuff. Um, I guess we'll get... Maybe we can try to get both of those. I don't know how quick caribou run. Oh dear. Uh oh. <laughs> Might be Grandpa Flantro time. That felt like a gut shot to me. 363? Yeah, she's number one on the leaderboard. I don't know how long this season's been going on. It had started not too long after I got my 70 turkey, I think. So, and they last for three months. But I think there's a real chance that ends up on the Hall of Fame. And like, I have basically two lifetime goals, maybe three lifetime goals in Classic. 100 kills of every species, because there's a profile banner you can get. Um, 1,000 kills with every bow. I don't know why, but that's a thing I've always wanted to do. And then get in the Hall of Fame. Why would you do that? 
Are you trying to be a goober? I mean, it's no fun if I just, like, take the safest shots ever. Literally insane? She... She said, like, there's a whitetail here. I don't want whitetail. Oh, it's a non-tip, and he's huge. And I look over, and I just see the frame that I've always wanted to see on a non-tip. Oh, all right. We know it's not vital. Uh, is that an L? Sandalaya? Am I saying that right? It's so small on my screen, I can't, I can't quite read it. But thank you for subscribing. We need timer. Start over at three minutes. Alrighty. I wonder how long I can do this before my voice gives out. Why do I sound like Bill Clinton? <laughs> ah, back in my day. Why must pizza do these things? This is weird to read the chat in this voice. I tell you what, Sonny. After I get married, you get 50% ownership of her lodge. That's not how that works, Sonny. See? She gets 50% ownership of my lodge, but not the other way around. Now, back when I was a boy, this is the shots everybody went for, but now these highfalutin fellers, they try to shoot animals in the head and in the neck. I, I tell you what, the lack of respect. Hey, Pixel, how's it going? I can't do it. This is great. Uh, that's what I always thought. Everybody loves my voice and... Well, anyway. Hey, Helmer. I'm in it in 43 seconds of this. Uh, I remember the last time I saw that time. Your ears burn? Well, Sonny, if you get some SPF 27 and uh, wear a hat. Two dollars? I used to be able to buy a gallon of milk for two dollars anymore. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> Truly beautiful. Like petunias. A hat? Yeah. Tuberculosis TJ. Dutch. I got tuberculosis Dutch. Wonder what happens when I go back to my normal voice after this. I, I haven't done that in a while. Gotta hurt. Oh yeah, it's great. Only 33 seconds. I can nearly walk from here to the other end of the room in 30 seconds. Keep doing this for the rest of the stream. Uh, well, that seems like a bad idea. I thought of doing the entire stream this way as April Fools, <laughs> but uh, I don't think that would work. I don't know, Danny, it's just, it's happening. I don't think I can do this in a British accent. <laughs> okay, it's over, that was great. <laughs> oh, I'll do that too many more times, I might lose my voice. It's a, here, I'll put the rules up, Aiden. It's a three minute uh, thing every time we make a gut shot, and uh, I did that. The cough was added, by the way, that I didn't have to do that. <laughs> How far did you walk to school? 12 miles uphill both ways, sonny. I think we'll ever see a great one on a bird species? Like, potentially one of the bigger birds. Caper, Kaylee, Turkey, I could see it. How long is the stream going to go without penalties? I'll do the regular two hours without penalties. I'm assuming at some point we'll miss. Every miss adds 15 minutes. 12 miles both ways and barefoot. Hey, you're darn right. Got a guaranteed diamond and whitetail? There you go. If your voice starts to hurt, you could get rid of the time and do old man flanner until you find the animal you gut shot. That's true. I don't know, like, I'd like to think that's only going to happen maybe three or four times, but it depends how many, um, <laughs> how many stream extensions happen. Because you would assume, like, every half hour or something that's going to happen again where I'm going to gut shot something. 
What do you think about the about Rodier Great One? Rodier get so much more impressive than the diamonds that we have here in Call of the Wild. It would be nice to give them some reason to be bigger in the game anyway, so why not? You should duck hunt? That's a grand idea. I think I would inevitably have like six hours of streaming immediately. Get off my lawn, you youngins. Quit skateboarding on the darn sidewalk. When I was fly fishing with Big the other day, that was his, uh, his old man thing, was the skateboarding on the sidewalk thing. That really did strain my voice pretty good. Think you're gonna herd manage crocs? I, I, uh, I assume you can do it. I don't know if it works or not. I haven't seen anybody doing it, but that doesn't mean it can't happen. Are there males anywhere? Oh. Well. We'll get that anyway. <laughs> Why is there Minecraft animals in Classic? Why not? You can indeed herd manage crocs. Sense make. I wasn't sure if like them being solo spawns would mess with it. I thought... Huh. That looked a little piebald to me, but I'm pretty sure it was that one. Which is not piebald at all. What's up, Bennett? Does... Oh, Pennsylvania and other eastern states have shed hunting seasons. It's about that time here in the west and it's already crazy. I don't know, because what you're talking about is like being able to go onto some public land and actually hunt for sheds, right? Because it, there is an actual season where you're allowed to do that, I believe, out west. I don't know if we have anything like that. I can tell you my dad has found eight sheds on private land. I, I forgot to bring that up. If you were in here earlier, I was talking about it. One of the things that has become maybe a three or four year tradition, my dad will hide like 30 eggs for like... Me, Kyla, my brother, his wife, my sister, her husband. And we, they're like actually difficult to find in the woods, up in trees, stuff like that. Anyway, me and my brother-in-law, we each need to find one more egg. We had a max of five that we could find. And we're walking along and there's a, an old disc from disking up the food plot, laying in the food plot. And I thought like, oh, dad would hide one between the discs. I'm going to get my fifth egg. I'm going to be done. Me and him go walking over there. My sister comes walking behind both of us. Hey, look! And picks up a shed. It was the matching side to one of the ones my dad has already found. So they found nine on that property now. I've seen the line of cars that happens out west for shed season. I'm guessing it looks maybe something like trout season here. Hey, Ribbit. Favorite trophy I have in Call of the Wild? So the Pieball Diamond Gray Fox, at least as far as things that are in my lodge, is probably my favorite. The Great One White Doll is always going to be special because of like the circumstances, but like in a sense, everybody has a Great One White Doll now. Not literally everybody, but you know what I mean. Um, as opposed to the Super Rare Gray Fox, only a handful of people have them. So if I could go back and get older trophies and put them in my lodge, my Albino Moose would be higher on the list, but... Since I don't have him in the lodge, like, not being able to walk by it every day and stuff makes it a little bit different. Pretty accurate, actually. I just remember... Boy, my chest hurts from doing... <laughs> didn't have enough air doing that old man voice. Anyway, I took Kyla camping. It was, like, our second date ever. And, um... I didn't know it. It wasn't the first day of trout. It was in May. But it was, like, the third uh, stocking of trout for that year. And there was a line of cars everywhere. I'm like, what's going on? Like, what is happening up here? I totally forgot that they were, they'd still stock that late. Uh, Danny, thank you for the super chat, by the way. Dad also said he was going to hide eggs. He must be hiding them real well. Been seven Easter since I seen him. He's just going to get the, the milk. You'll be all right. Appreciate the support, by the way. What's that? See, I almost just like bl blast that. And I realized like, oh, hey, that's like exactly not what we're allowed to do today. It's a five. And a four. Oh, trying to get both could be interesting. They run fast. <laughs> Tell me about fly fishing. Uh, big caught a fish. I didn't. That's it. 
The water was really low and really clear, so it wasn't ideal conditions by any stretch. I got a hit on my second cast. And I, like, that second cast of the year, that was the first trip I've been out. Missed that one. Being not warmed up or whatever. Never got another hit the entire trip. If you're getting the basic stuff like the 7 mil and the Hyperion scope, what do you recommend getting? Are you just talking about, like, unlocking stuff, or are you looking to buy DLCs? Because that's this probably going to be completely different recommendations. What are you catching on? Oh, jeez. I don't even remember what he had. I think he had a... He might have had a Caddis Fly dropper, but I think it hit the dry. And I really can't remember what he had as the, the dry fly. It was a dry droppering, but... You're lucky you're not on Twitch because all the bits would be switching maps and iron sights. I thought about doing something like that. But a YouTube version of it. And then I was like, I don't want to make it like... I, I hate the idea of incentivizing like, hey... If you pay $5, I'll do this. Like, I don't want to do that. So that's why I made it, like, all down to me being bad at the game, essentially. Because it, ju it just feels like that's a slippery slope to just not not a good reputation, I guess. So, yeah, that, that's one, one reason that I set it up this way. If we could do channel points on YouTube, that'd be one thing. What's your biggest buck in real life? It is 171 and 3 eighths was the uh, net non-typical score. If you look... Oh, actually, it's not in... No, it is, but I think... Yeah. That one. It's in my channel banner, too, but... He was 180 and 6 eighths gross score, so... Not too bad for a PA buck, I guess. Uh, why does that say gifted zero memberships? <laughs> How weird. And then it shows it... All right. You do you stream elements. You're doing great. Joshua, thank you for the get the sub 2k flow, or membership even. I really appreciate that. D despite the zero that it said. Very much appreciate the support. K flow is already in here saying thank you, so I guess I don't have to say my spiel, but thank you again, Joshua. Should all Flinder get to 400,000 subs? I will say there will be a 24-hour uh, stream over on Twitch when we get to 400k. I just enjoy walking, so I'll take my GoPro and hike. Try to walk new areas every time I go out. I'm looking forward to, especially like, I, I'm so like uh, scarred by walking right past that shed that my sister found when we were Easter egg hunting yesterday. I really want to get out and walk my property now. Maybe tomorrow, we'll see. Well, I appreciate it, Josh. Uh, what is the, ma the new max way for Bobcat? I think it's... They're different. Is it... 18 kilo for New England and 14 for Rancho? Something like that? 24 hour combined stream with Kylo that incorporates a drinking game. For the... Like the 400k one? Here's the thing. That seems like a good idea. And then you think like... You have to time the drinking game up really well because otherwise what's going to happen is you're going to get really tired and <laughs> just lose all energy for the rest of the stream. 20 kg? Is it? Maybe it... Well, somebody that definitely knows can say it in chat because I, I probably have it backwards. What happened if you find a female rare? I think, it, I, I think what we're going to do is if we find a female rare, I just have to shoot it. Therefore, all of the... Um, all of the rules will just take place. It seems unfair to just not shoot one. You know what I mean? Like, the spirit of the challenge is kind of to make it a longer stream and to get to do some of the meme stuff. It is April Fool's after all, so... I don't know how likely it is that we do find one, but should that happen, I, I think we'll just make it a requirement that we have to do those things. Not as many Grizzlies as I thought. So get them into their daylight zones, there must be... Maybe they drink, um... Over here now. Let's go see. 20 on New England, 18 on Rancho. Okay. I was close. Blended Big Mac meals? No, why? Ew. <laughs> yeah, it's cool that they made them different, Loungefly, because, you know, like... Realistically, one that lives in a hotter environment probably is going to be a little bit lighter. I appreciate that they took the time to add that detail instead of just copy-paste stuff, you know? 
What's up, assassins? It's going good. Um, we've thus far had to do one no sights shot based on the rules and one um, three minute extended version of Gra Grandpa Flantro. It's really hard to do that for three full minutes, I have learned. That is the April Fool's challenge, uh, April Fool's event demon, not challenge in classic. Drink a Mountain Dew through Beagle socks? Ew. No. I don't want to drink a Mountain Dew through anybody's socks. That is insane, Nevada. 385 sheds? Did you get to keep them? Like, meaning, does she have them? Do you have them? Like, who, who got to keep them? Blocktail deer, indeed. What's the easiest thing to grind for? Well, that depends. Are you looking for a great one, or do you want, like, just any diamond? The ease of grinding for a diamond, obviously. Significantly easier than grinding for a great one. Gotta be careful, I can't just start yeeting shots at things. Excuse you, sir. Pick a map for me. Last time you did a couple weeks ago, I got another diamond boost and a diamond white tail from Rev. How about... Hmm. How about Emerald Coast? I've been having a good time doing some Emerald Coast stuff lately. We've been after uh, Crocs quite a bit. Chasing Bantang around. I don't know if we killed anything special last... We killed a troll croc is what it was. Because we did an angler and... Um... Croc stream on Twitch or YouTube? I don't even know where I did it. I think that was last Friday on Twitch. It was a good time. Great one? Probably followed you then. My best friend and partner visit I've been yapping about for a month and a half happened last week. Hands down the best week of my life. That's good to hear, man. Glad it went well. She kept them. I was scoring, but finders and keepers? Hey, that's, that's fair enough. It's the way it goes, I guess. Do you have Loungefly, like some kind of mount with the Shed Incorporated? There's a... A fairly local outdoors... Well, yeah, outdoor, like... Shop? I don't know. It seems like the wrong word. It's where I go to get my bow tuned and... Or, uh, yeah. Tuned, put new sights on, put new strings on, all that kind of stuff every year. The guy that owns it now, he married the original owner's daughter. So he owns it and runs and stuff. The original owner's retired. But that guy shot one of the biggest bucks in PA. It's the only PA buck I've ever actually laid eyes on, like even dead, that was bigger than the one I shot. Different counties, so as far as like the record thing goes, it's, I think it's 186 or something. But anyway, he has a couple of the sheds in the full body mount with him. It's pretty cool. Sounds good, bottom boy. Uh, if I bought two DLCs, which would you recommend? Either maps or weapon packs. Like, if you don't own any, I would get... Here's what I would do. I would probably get either the high caliber pack, because the 300 AR is pretty darn good, or maybe the modern, modern rifles pack. It depends on, you know, do you hunt a lot of Cape Buffalo, Bison, or would you like to? Because in that case, the 300 AR is going to be a, a really good thing to have. If you're more into deer and smaller species, I'd get the modern rifles. You can play any map, even if you don't own it in multiplayer. So I would just try out different maps, hang on to your eight bucks or whatever for the map DLC, and then pick one that you really like and purchase that like from actually getting to experience it in multiplayer. Is your deer county record? It's the second biggest non-typical ever shot in the county. It's the biggest since 1942, I think. And it's funny, the guy that got the the one in 1942. That was shot, like, within 20 minutes of where I grew up. The best gummy candy? Can you beat just regular old gummy worms? I don't know. Okay, I'm convinced grizzly don't exist. We're gonna go find wolves and make this more interesting. You love gummy bears? We had a, uh, 
I forget the exact context of how this happened, but we went for like a, a day trip, fishing with my cousin and aunt and uncle, probably 15 years ago, something like that. And it was Good Friday, so we couldn't eat meat. So we stopped at this place for dinner and just got cheese pizza. It was horrible. Like I'm tell this is the only pizza in my life I couldn't eat, and it wasn't just me. Like I, I was a, I'm still a picky eater kind of, but I was a really picky eater back then. It wasn't just me. Like my aunt and uncle couldn't believe how terrible it was. My brother, who was like a garbage disposal, especially at that time, wouldn't eat it. So we each, they had like a gift shop thing. So we each got like a one pound tub of gummy bears <laughs> and ate those for dinner on the drive home. IRL challenge, catch a trout on a gummy worm? I don't know how quickly they disintegrate, but I, I bet that would be pretty doable. Hey, David. Haribo gummy worms, just not the sugar-free ones? <laughs> yeah, I've, I've seen the reviews and stuff. Apparently, bad things happen. Mel gonna be fighting Kyla? I can't believe that, dude. <laughs> She's sitting over there like she had just killed the her first block tail deer, which I still don't have. I spent two hours, couldn't find one. I'm like I'm legit I thought like I'm, I'm seeing people post them they didn't April Fool's me or like some people right and not put them in the game but anyway she killed one of those while I was eating lunch and I was gonna get ready for the stream and then she's sitting there and she goes oh there's a whitetail I don't want one oh it's a huge non tip and I just look and I see that frame and I'm like that's probably gonna be number one on the leaderboards I know exactly what frame that is I've seen it in the, the trophy shots the 370 ish frame 363 What's going on, Clark? Gummy Coke bottles? They're all right. Like, they're one of those weird ones where if you eat a couple of them, you get used to them. But the first one's kind of like, oh, that doesn't taste quite right. Like, it doesn't taste like Coke like you expect. Is that a bird? Where are you going? Oh, I guess your zone's over. Hey. See, am I allowed to shoot in the air with the 22? I think that counts as missing. Oi. Oh, good. What an angle. What am I supposed to do with that? I guess I gotta alert him. Currently driving, can't miss the stream. Hey, what's going on, man? Did you get any fishing done over the weekend? Could crush pounds of sour. I don't know what a jujube -jube is. I've never heard of that in my life. Do you know what that is? Whatever soup's talking about? Some kind of gummy thing? No. I've never, never heard of those. Three or four fried eggs a day? Hmm. Depends. I would do four, but I like eggs. How many misses so far? We haven't missed, but we have had one non-vital and one intestine shot. I'm kind of intentionally trying to go for some, like, difficult shots in the interest of <laughs> making things interesting. The, uh... The three minutes of Grandpa Flantro was really interesting. I don't know how many times I can do that. Like, genuinely, I gotta be careful to not do too many, or I'm gonna lose my voice. <laughs> it was hard on the old voice box. Is that too far forward? Nope, we're good. Never once, Colby. I don't even know what they are. Hey, Joe. Didn't get out, but my Reddington came. Nice. Hopefully you get a chance to use that. I don't know if I'm gonna get out here before... I go to Kentucky, I'd like to. Just content prepping and everything that's gotta happen beforehand. They look like regular fruit snacks? Is it like a type of fruit snack then? How many great ones? Five, I have one of each species. Got a one there, woo, that was close though. <laughs> Little high. Like the great one moose shot all over again. Do you prefer normal Sour Patch Kids or watermelon? I don't know if I've ever had the watermelon ones. I don't really eat Sour Patch Kids as is. Like even when I was a kid, I didn't I didn't have them very often. I would probably prefer watermelon ones though. Like what I do really like, which I guess to be really similar, those little like watermelon let me get the watermelon gummies. I don't know. I think they had the sour stuff on them, so probably same thing. Barely eat candy anymore. My mom got us a huge Easter basket with so much candy, so I'm definitely gonna get fat in the next couple days. But it's about the only time of year, like 
some sort of holiday where candy's involved. That's about the only time I eat anything. Alright, soup has sent me whatever these things are. I mean, I feel like I've had very similar ones. They're, they're probably close enough. Favorite table? Uh, I think a good a good uh, walnut table. I, I don't understand the question. <laughs> I've enlightened you with what is... Wait, why are those sour jujubes? pubes? I don't understand. They don't look like much, but they are delish. All right, then. Artificial watermelon and cherries insanely good? I cannot disagree there. What time is it now? When do planes bison drink? They're eight, right? Yeah. Start blasting some of them or not. Nobody home. Hmm. Well then. Hickory's the best. Depends on what you stain it with. I, I like a good walnut stain. That's that's the difference. Ash is the best wood. Ash has like a unique look. Depends on what you're going for. I, I can get behind that. I think that's what my parents' TV stand is, like an ash. Do you have Cadbury mini eggs in the States? Yes. Uh, anything good yet? Nothing, nothing to speak of, I don't think. Had a couple of oof shots that have incorporated some of our rules. I'll, uh, throw those on screen again so you can see. Oh, nice, JTAC. What's going on, Ethan? Uh, nothing, nothing crazy yet. Couple of whiffs that, uh, got the rules going, but no special trophies just yet. What do you think the next hunting location area will be? Like, next map? I really can't, like, I, I don't have, I feel like most times I'm like, okay, it's, it's probably going to be, you know, like, they used to pretty consistently do, like, North America and Europe, like, you know, one of each in, in a year. Because we haven't had a map now in, whatever, nine months, I think, it's harder to gauge. What was the last map? It was Emerald Coast, huh? I doubt they'd do North America again. Like, half the maps in the game are North America. We know it's not Africa. Could it be... Um, I think we said Patagonia's already... What about, like, Mongolia? I don't know what's there to hunt, but I, I'm pretty sure that's a very, like, wildlife-diverse place. Best place to... to grind blacktail for diamonds? I think Chila and Norden are pretty loaded. Balmont doesn't have nearly as many as it used to. Favorite type of water? Um, other than the mountain stream that feeds our, like, our house water, like Deer Park, which Kyla hates Deer Park. I don't under, like, I, I don't get it, but Kyla would rather great, great value Walmart bottled water than Deer Park. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that, but Deer Park's by far my favorite. You know what I hate, though? Because I used to get it when, I, when I lived in my apartment, I had city water. And eventually I got, like, a little filter thing that took the chlorine taste out of it, but I couldn't, could not drink that from the tap, so I always got bottled water. Dasani makes me more thirsty. I don't understand it. I don't know if it's designed to make you drink more of their water. It's, I can't. <laughs> it's a problem. I'm a furniture maker, so this wood conversation's even better than NFL talk. Do you, uh, like, when you're watching, or, sorry, when you're making furniture, do you, um... Say, like, listen to NFL podcasts or watch games. Or listen to games, I guess. Oh, what? Oh, God. This is good. <laughs> is it going to land? Please land. Just land. I'm going to miss so many times if it doesn't land. Oh, no. I never thought of this. It's not even big. It maxes at eight. Just land. It's fine. Just land. They're still circling, so I think they want to land. I don't even have a shotgun, so like... I need to watch where they're going to go. They're going to want to land... Like, from the way we're facing now, from like our feet to our head. They're going to land that direction because of the wind. I'm going to watch what that one's 
doing? Is that the five? No. Where'd it go? There he is. Oh boy. Uh. Okay, we have found the right spot. That one was trying to land. I'm sure it was. What are they doing? Is that them spooking? All right. Ah, I was gonna try to time that up. I guess we're gonna try to get it. Oh, oh one miss. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take one miss. All right, so now we got 15 extra minutes. So now the stream end time is gonna be 4:15 without another miss. Nice pizza. <laughs> is this live? This is live. Uh, I missed that as well. Ian, thank you for the super chat. We need a scarecrow collab. I like water and gum. What? <laughs> Wait. Was that what that was supposed to say? Hey, thank you, Rusty. Pretty clutch, though. I will absolutely take one miss for that. What time is it for you? It is 3 p.m. I was going to do... Um, is that off the screen? I need to move that over a little bit. Anyway, I was going to do that little graphic thing on the bottom right saying what time it would end, but considering that everybody's time zones are different, that seems like a worse way to do it. I hope he at least makes it. I hate this game. <laughs> All that effort and concern just to get a troll. April Fools! Yeah, yeah, I get you, Call the Wild. Thanks. Appreciate you. Let me move that thing because that's going to bother me. 9 p.m. for you? Yeah, that that's, uh... Well, for one, I appreciate you being here this late, but that's why I wanted to do it that way. Alright. Scoot this. More like that. That looks better. Alright. Got fooled. Got fooled indeed. Big strokes. Big lag, too, when it's trying to snow. I don't know what's up with that. Never had any issues on Yukon. There's got to be wolves out here somewhere, too. I'm perplexed. <laughs> Been live for an hour and seven minutes. Can't find a wolf. If you unloaded the clip, it would have made Diamond just saying. Is that right? Just like all your level three whitetails. It's funny that that seems to be a trend here in chat. A lot, a lot of people mentioned getting trolls yesterday and today, and here we are. <laughs> I know you don't get trolled. You kill... You, April Fool's for you is like, well, maybe it's because April's your birth month or something, but April Fool's for you is like peak big male time. It's Skyence, is that right? Favorite map? Leighton Leaks. Just fell through the map on Hirschfeld? Really? There were some issues with falling through the map years and years ago in Call of the Wild, but I haven't seen that happen in a long time. Some very laggy looking geese. I am snow goose hunting. Ooh, nice. Gonna be that guy unless it's the M1. It's not a clip, it's a mag. I'm bad with, like... It's not that I don't know which is which, but I'm really bad about just saying clip for either uh, usage. It is. I was just reading it funny. Drove off a cliff, so that probably didn't help. Eh, that could have had something to do with it. That, that certainly could have impacted what's going on. What's up, man? Anything good? We just got trolled by a goose, so call the wild. Say April Fool's to us. Ian, thank you for becoming a shoesty, by the way. That will come up in a second, but it's just taking its sweet time. Very much appreciate that. That's a uh, renewal, right, though, because it's green badge? Pretty confident. I think it's just YouTube lying to me. Trolled by a goose? Get goosed. I get it. Found a diamond wild boar? Nice, what a map. Last time I've seen issues with the Hirschfelden was the roads in the sky. A couple of maps had that, I think. The Hirschfelden was bad, though. <laughs> That's fair, Clark. I thought so, Ian. Welcome back, man. I appreciate it. That must be why I didn't pop up then. Did you see the classic update? Yes, that'll be tomorrow's video. Assuming I can find one. I spent two hours earlier. Did not find one. It's a 
solo wolf? I don't even know if it'll go aggressive, but we'll chase it. <laughs> Same people who complain about clip mag are the ones that correct you for horn slash antlers. Am I right in that uh, Meat Eater podcast with Jeff Foxworthy? Didn't he say something about that? Like, he calls them horns and he doesn't he doesn't care that people are going to get mad. Something like that. Did they change Grizzly Drink Time? Yes. It is now 4 a.m. to 8 a.m. Same as Black Bear. And by the way, Brown Bear got that change too. You do have to shoot them from their night zones to get them into the day zones, much like Black Bear. We did that here. And I, I kind of think our Grizzlies are like sort of spreading out on the map. You'll see that when you grind things. If you start a Great One grind, you will see some zones that are loaded early on. Animals kind of move around some. We've got that happening with our grizzly population, so now they're all over the place. The horns antler thing is just facts. It's almost, but like, it is, but it's also, um... Oh, what's the word? Is it like a colloquialism? Like, per I would almost say, like, redneck colloquialism is just to call antlers horns. I called them horns growing up. I don't know if it was YouTube or when I started saying antlers instead, but, you know, knowing the comments I would get. See, sometimes I think I should do it on purpose. <laughs> get massive interaction for the videos. Look at the size of the horns on that one. Flantro actually. Favorite rare is albino bighorn because they look like a doll sheep. I just wish their horns didn't look so weird. You're a colloquialism, but is that the right word? Did I did I do the English properly? Big engagement analytics. Yeah, I think that's my new that's my new model on YouTube. Just say things wrong. I had a uh, in that ARs versus Africa or for Hunga, whatever I called it video. I shot a couple of Gensbach by accident with the 300 and immediately like addressed it like, oh geez, I used the wrong gun. And I had like four or five comments that said like, hey, did you know? Did you use the 300 on Gensbuck? I was like, yeah. I said it right after I did it. What do you mean? <laughs> so I just need to do more stuff like that. And then I'm going to be the biggest YouTuber. I'm going to pass Mr. Beast in like a day and a half. Oh, I thought we missed. <laughs> I was going to be a little upset. Uh, Ian, thank you for the super chat as well. Why change the pronghorn? I'm assuming you're talking about pronghorn classes. I'm going to assume that I like water and gum was intended now that I uh, see that you said it again. Why change the pronghorn? So, I don't know. I, I'm not really sure. Like, they are a not super beefy species in real life. Like, that would kind of rhyme. A lot of people do use, you know, 223s and stuff like that for them, but a lot of people use bigger calibers too. I, I'm not quite sure why they made that move. Horns equals no split off slash antlers equals split off multiple points. Are you... I see what you're saying. Are you saying antlers... Sorry. Spikes have horns. Fork horns have antlers. Am I getting that right? What was soup nitpicking? I missed it. Semantic, not pedantic. I think he's right, though, isn't he? I mean, I, I, can, uh, I can get behind that one, Reinhardt. It's close enough. I am... I find I am more likely to call spikes horns than antlers. Compared to any other antlered animal. I am PewDiePie. I mean, I did do one stream back when T-Series was about to pass PewDiePie. Just as a complete meme. Um, saving PewDiePie. Or shooting animals to save PewDiePie or something was the stream title. I forget what we called it. Preferred hunting caliber? I don't really have, like, one particular caliber where I'm, like... Uh, yes, everybody should use this, and those that don't are crazy. Like some some people have more of an opinion like that. I I love my Weatherby Vanguard Seven and Mod Eight, but if someone wants to use something else and does well with it, cool with that too. Where are the wolves? Who has taken my wolves? Shooting pixels to save PewDiePie. I think you're right. I don't know if you just looked it up, but I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Hot honey Pringles. What is that? 
I knew I heard some. Every shot just has a little more adrenaline behind it. Mel ate the wolves. No, Mel has the six pack. Dead. Could have been a could have been a spinal cord, but all is well. Just run around in the ATV in the recovering forest. They don't still chase ATVs, do they? I know they used to. Do you like the 308 in real life? I'm assuming you've shot one. I think I shot my buddy's 308 when I was young, but I've never shot a deer or like anything like that to have an idea of performance. Aaron has one, I think. Like from what I know, they do well. I would certainly use one, but it's not something I have any actual experience hunting with. A six pack, sir, you can you not? We are not howling in laughter after that one. I don't know who this was worth. Worth? Worth? Worth hearing. Worse, I think I read. Uh, Loungefly, thanks for becoming a member, man. Really appreciate that. Why'd that not come up in chat? It just came up in the alerts. How weird. Either way, dude, I very much appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. I know you are already in the Discord. So uh, be sure to link up the YouTube to get the member roll as well. <laughs> Sounds good, Ian, later. I want a 17 in this game. This class is one to three. Three, like, if so that would be able to shoot Axis Tier. You know what I mean? Like, on the upper ends of it, it's probably a little bit much. Maybe if you made it really weak on Axis Tier, I could get behind it. Because on the lower end, uh, Lynx, 17 small for a Lynx, but I, I guess you could reasonably take a Lynx with a 17. I don't know, that, that's a tough one to decide. I was a member and I have a program that keeps kicking me out. I kind of thought you were, <laughs> but I was like, oh, maybe, I, maybe I'm misremembering. You creating servers with more 400 inch whitetail? I went AFK and got killed by a Caper Kaylee on my ATV sitting there. Does the ATV still spook things if you're just sitting still? Uh, see, I can't shoot that. Because otherwise, it's against the rules. What was your first animal to kill? In, in the game or in real life? In real life, it was a groundhog. In the game, it was a blacktail... Or no, I guess a roe deer because I had Hirschfelden in the little, like, early access beta testing thing. Seventeen HMR or WSM would be money. We use them for coyotes a lot. Do you think it would be too small then for Axis Deer-ish size species? I think Axis Deer are the biggest class three. Square enough. I know I'm going to run up this tower if it keeps following me. Did it leave already? <laughs> what a wimp. Taking my great-grandfather's 32 cal liver action out in the rifle next year. I had a couple of cousins that... I think they used a 32 at some stage. That's cool, though. Like, I killed... I think it was my second turkey ever with my grandfather's uh, 12 gauge. Just a neat little, like, connection thing there. Should run a dog to fight your female battles? I never thought of that. New rule dies to aggressive animal. You must avenge your own death regardless of consequences. Since we're going to almost have to avoid shooting female wolves, or at least attempt to avoid it, I can get behind that. Just remind me if I do it. <laughs> the old saying, you can kill anything with anything, is true, but not great. Yeah, do it like at the... You know, the perfect shot at the right range and everything. It is pretty much true. What other games do you play other than hunting games? Lately, not much. It's, it's pretty much just been classic Call of the Wild or Wade Hunter. On my Switch at night, I'll play Pokemon Brilliant Diamond because 
elite nerd status, I guess. But uh, that's about the only game I played. I was playing Subnautica a decent bit, like a month ago. Uh, what else do I have on here? I played Planet Zoo for like five minutes a couple weeks ago. The Angler, does that count? Non-hunting game? For what, JTAC? I know you reinstalled Madden to get the Pride of Plum. I did not, but I, I'm only assuming he's going to only be 99 overall for maybe the week. It'll, it'll be an April Fool's thing. The seal exhibit that didn't exist? I tried to do one. Is it out on console? No, it is, huh? There must be wolves somewhere. It's a decent moose. Another moose. Are we just goose hunters now? Like, <laughs> can't get away from the things today. Nobody over there. Well, we better kill that. That's pretty good. <laughs> Up to 310. 256 minimum. I see no wolves, so away we go. Where was he? Could be awkward, but I think it'll be fine. A little worried on that one. Yeah, bottom boy. They did a, the, in Madden, they did a uh, middle linebacker, 99 overall, 99 everything, Pat McAfee. <laughs> <laughs> That's their April Fool's thing. Streamed for like four hours of the Brie, it's amazing. And you didn't tell me you were streaming it? I don't watch. I like to watch people that know how to play that game, stream it and stuff. Like, I like to play it, and I, I spend like so long, you know, potentially hours on one exhibit placing every rock and every tree and shrub and everything and I'm like ah yes a good exhibit and then I watch someone that actually knows what they're doing and I see it and it just like I'm like wow I made basically a box for animals compared to what this is I'm back, I got Pokemon loading, a pack and a half of gum, and a cup of freezing cold water. I'm ready to watch the stream. What Pokemon game are you playing? Now I'm interested. I wish I had gotten... So I have a Switch Lite, by the way. I talked about Brilliant Diamond a minute ago. I wish I had gotten an original Switch just to stream, like, random Pokemon game stuff. Because the Switch Lite you can't uh, stream with. Which it snowed like this on Reventuli? I don't get why any map that's not, like, a summer map why they don't do, like, snow textures. I guess it's more things to design, but it'd be cool if we had more snow maps. Sword? Okay. That's the one I had from that generation. Are you bored by your own stream? What did I, I don't even know what I said interested about. Oh, the Pokemon thing. Well, no, I was specifically interested in what he was after there. Close. <laughs> I don't know if that's quite as bad as a troll goose, but they're messing with us. Guess we'll run around up here a little bit. I, I'm going to be annoyed if we don't kill a single wolf today. Been hooked on Pokemon for the last couple months. Which one? There's such good ones. The thing that I really like about Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, like, they, they tried to do the old art style again. Like, a, a modern version of it. But it's the, you know, like, kind of bobblehead looking character, sort of overhead view. I just, like, I appreciated the nostalgia of it. Not unless you choose to continue a rivet. Oh, Poke MMO. I see what you're saying now. I thought you just misspelled it. I don't think I've ever played that one. What was the one? Pokemon Revolution was something like that, an online one, that I played some. Any of the Angler stream? Not today. Uh, only because we're... It, it, I wanted to do the angler today like we've been doing for a bunch of our streams, but I, other than like what, missing a strike, I couldn't come up with a way to, you know, add rules like we have for, for this one. Been hooked on Fishing Planet, I see what you did there. Uh, there's a Fishing Planet on mobile? I didn't know this. I had no idea that was a thing. Playing Flappy Bird. The hype of Flappy Bird, like, I don't know. 12, 13 years ago, however long ago that was, was insane. 
Uh, they did like some sort of challenge thingy for Easter Reinhardt with rabbits. I'm unsure if they did anything April Fool's related. Boy, if we were looking for caribou today, we'd be doing great. <laughs> no struggle finding them whatsoever. Where'd that fox go? Uh, are these the new tracks? If they are, he's hiding. Do you work out? I used to work out quite a bit. Now, my workouts are like... Basically anything to do with, you know, property maintenance, whether it's running a chainsaw, there's some wolves, or, uh... Like mowing the grass, there's a... It's about an eight-hour job to mow my grass, so it's at least a little bit of a workout. I haven't, like, you know, actively set out to work out in quite a while. I haven't whiffed yet. At least on, like, a scary running shot, I mean. So, like... Why didn't you attack me? Woo, almost shot the ground. Oh, no. Did he move in time? I was sure we got that. Dang it. <laughs> I don't know what that's going to be. It wasn't a miss that hit him. Is there anything for April foul in Call of the Wild? Waterfowl. No, I, I don't think there's anything other than what we're making up here. Whiff? I, I swear it hit him, right? Maybe, maybe I did miss. Got the vitals there. I thought I saw blood. He's not dead. What a whiff, bruv. If I could say something in, in British ease that would be funny, I would. Hey, we hit him. Wait. Did I not? Hold on. Oh, no, that's not blood. That's just dirt. Maybe I did miss. Might have a half hour of stream extension. No, he is hit. So that me, what is that one? <laughs> now I got myself confused. That is... No organs hit, no sights for the next shot. They always do that speed walk glitch? Yeah, I find, like, uh, big animals, water buffalo, cape buffalo do it. And then almost every predator. Foxes, jackal, wolves. April Fowl's Day? I wish I had been smart enough to come up with that. <laughs> Could have just done, um... Bird hunting all day. So I didn't miss. We don't have to extend the stream just yet. However, this open sights thing could get interesting. Might need search well. You know, you might be right. It's either not going to kill him. Nope, he just died. Uh, is that blood? Yeah. How long is the stream? At the moment, we have 45 minutes left. If we miss any shots, it extends by 15 minutes for every miss. I think we'll ever get the Hunter 3? Is Call of the Wild the Hunter 2? Is that, is that the route we're going here? I imagine. Like, they have succeeded so well with both of their games. I don't see why they wouldn't do another one down the line. You shot a diamond of Red Deer? Nice. Well, I bet you he's dead right about there, then. Can't imagine seeing a Bighorns level 9k buffalo doing the speedy boy glitch. I didn't have a Bighorns one doing it, but I was following one around, I don't know, a couple of weeks back that did it a couple of times. It's really, it'll break your immersion pretty quick how hyped you get to like chase a big male. What are we hunting? I'm trying to get wolves to attack us. We haven't had any attack us yet. It has, Reinhardt. Um... I thought about bringing Shadow on some hunt recently, and I, I couldn't even tell you why I ended up not. I'm going to assume the wolves are back there. Can't even shoot that. I'm going to jump over it. I'm ready. I don't think it's... No! I don't think it's possible, but I <laughs> wanted to try. Uh, this thing ran forever. It's only at 50 to 75. Favorite tree? 
Hemlock because it's the it's a amazing place to hang a stand. It's got free cover set and amazing just visual cover. We need more stream. Well, let's see if we can miss something else. I guess. White oak, that's a good one as far as bringing the deer there. You jumped over a water buffalo. Did you take any damage? I guess in my mind, like, what I say is not possible. I mean to literally take no damage from it. I have jumped over some stuff. But it always hits me. If EW ever had an April Fool's post about Classic getting a new map, and they didn't make it happen, I'd probably cry, but it'd be a great April Fool's joke. They did, um, the best one I think they ever did. Because they've done, like, they did the Robits one year. They did, like... Rabbits with a unicorn horn. Those were European rabbits too, as I believe uh, I recall. There was a goose hat thing that, that was a fake release. The one that I think got people the most, at least from what I could tell, was they had a post on their socials that said they were releasing a 50 cal. And everybody was so excited. In the background of the photo was a cottontail rabbit. That should have given it away. But everybody was like... People got mad that they weren't adding the 50 cal when they said they were. Never even been in a place where wolves could attack me that I know of, ZBG. Thanks for the amazing content. Well, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. What is the best tree in the Hunter Classic? Uh, any tree that allows you to hang a stand low and not behind branches. Oh my god, it's way over there. That's my spot, first of all. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, mine's literally on that island right where you're looking. It's not the same. It's a different tree. Right. Kylo wants a treadmill. Can you just tell me your address so I can send it your way? For legal reasons, this is a joke. Um, 12, 12, 12. Big mail lane. 12sville. Pennsylvania. What gun would you shoot the wolves if they attack you in real life? <sighs> Whatever I'm holding, I don't know. Small meal. Ooh, nice, Joe. Is Kylo hunting the block tail? Yeah, and killing number one leaderboard knot tips instead. It, it'll take a day or two to pop up, but it's it's bigger than the number one, so it'll be up there. He might have ducked a little bit, but I think I was just bad on that one. So what, I need to go no sights on our next shot. Fair enough, Mill. Need to find something to shoot with no sights. Beisner drinking like that right there. Can take on 12 wolves with a machete and a pack of Marlboros. Uh, back in my day. I took on the wolves for fun. No organs hit technically, so time for old man Flantro? Wait, do I have it backwards? I think it's non vitals, uh, old man Flantro. Unless you're saying it's technically not a vital. That might be what you're saying. Oh boy. This could be good. <laughs> Can you turn? Sir? I'm like squinting and way up close to the screen so I can... <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, he went back to... Alright. Well, now I need to alert him. Old man Flanch already has 10 million sub subscribers. Holy! I don't even know what a subscriber is. Why am I Bill Clinton again? Well, I tried to heart shot it. That didn't work. I might need to no sights again. I'm gonna assume that was no organs hit. Do I need to shoot from here again? That seems like only fair. That'll get him. It's gonna die in the water, isn't it? Man's went submarine mode on us. Oh. You're doing fine, bud. Great work. He still fell in the water. 
Maybe it's not gonna float, I can't tell. Don't worry, it'll drown. That's my one way to maybe kill him. Did you get the goose? Yes, and he trolled. Got a 32 scoring white tail. Holy Kyla, better watch out. So if one of the shots was non-vital or a flesh hit, do you still get punished if you save it? Yeah, I feel like if, if uh, even if I save it, it still has to be, like it enacts whatever uh, consequence thing I have listed. So we did the, wait, I think I see what you're asking me. Like, does that count as me saving it? Because I used the no sights again. So I, I think we did that correctly. He's embarrassed he got shot. Man, that wasn't even bad. I think we were dead on for the heart, right? Right side of the heart, but it just didn't didn't reach. I'm not mad about that. Okay. I know there's like a lot of wolves in this area now, but sure not existing today. Hunting the April Fool's thing in classic, nice. I think that's what I'm gonna do after the stream. Got a 62 non-tip? Holy! I'm pretty sure I got a 50-some back in the day. I, I want to say it's in like a headshot video, but could I find it? No idea. What's up, Pond Hockey? Uh, how many kills did it take to get your Great One Bear? I didn't count, but it, it had to be like 8,000. I did 5,000... A little over 5,000, as I recall. Um, like, say, in the first year they came out, and then I took a pretty significant break from them. When I came back in January, I was getting hundreds of kills a day, and I think it was two or three weeks. So it can, that adds up pretty quick. For no size, recreate the no scope recurve shot you did on the buffalo. Unsure if I can do that again, literally ever. That sounds about right, Madwe. On loggers with the 300? That's that's my recollection. It was definitely loggers. I wouldn't remember the gun. How's it going, by the way? What is the best gun in the Hunter Classic, in your opinion? Like, best gun overall? Probably, I mean, like, the, the 9.3 by 74R has such great coverage. Even just a good old 300 bolt? covers almost everything. Sort of down to, you know, some degree of personal preference because the, the thing about the 9.3, it's heavy and that can cause more weapon sway, but it's at least got the, the follow-up shot that the 300 doesn't. I'm about 90% sure it was... Oh, but it was, but the small ones just look so funny. Tiny non-tips in this game are just, or in classic rather, are just, it's almost, um, I guess it's almost akin to like a troll in Call of the Wild. Because you know, to some degree you found something that's a little bit rare, but then it's so small that it's just pitiful. For an all-around big game gun and classic, I love the 9.3 by 62 It's a good caliber as well. I don't know if it's ethical for water buffalo. That's like the one thing that it might not be allowed for. Tiny non-tips suck. Sag. Waiting for trout season on Saturday. I'll be going to Doomans with the buddy Sunday morning. There you go. Is Doomans usually packed? I imagine it has to be. Chasing wolves is the worst. Uh, yeah, I don't expect them to go aggressive. I wish, like, we could just get one pack of aggressive wolves. Just one. That's all I want. Makes this 12 times more interesting, and they're just not having it. There's a season for trout? Yep. Favorite wheel on a car? The, uh... The spare? <laughs> what crick isn't packed Saturday? Well, Doomans is a... a damn but yeah I, I don't know if there's anywhere that isn't packed like the new skin on the binoculars 
Just a little leftover from the Easter challenge. Fending off wolves with the 10 mil. That would have been... We could maybe grab the 10 mil, but I don't know if they're going to attack us anyway at this point. A male. Things we can shoot. How would you view if they had jaguars with an Amazon map? I think that'd be good. Now, I don't know what other species... Uh, would, like, I imagine you'd have, like, what, caimans, maybe? I, I don't know what other, like, big game would be there to get people's interest, but... I think that could be a neat idea. <laughs> Send you to the moon. If the 50 cal was in the game, Doc would say he's disappointed in us. Something about being dressed... Oh, hello. Dressed up as a mushroom and saw you using a 50 cal. Did he run here? No. Orange fur type, though. We don't get a lot of them. So what happened? This is going this way. Oh, he ran... How did, I guess I just didn't see that track. Capybara. Yes. The largest, uh, what are they, marmots? I always get this wrong. I'll be sleeping in and thinking about all the people out there fighting over crossing lines for stocked fish. Yeah, I'll, I'll get out the weekend after once, uh, once it calms down. Rodent. Is it rodent? I almost said rodent, but I thought that was wrong. Dang it. Every time. Hey, that ain't bad, Madwee. If you're catching them like that, yeah, you can, can maybe deal with a couple extra people. How's this thing completely avoiding our line of sight? I'm, I'm pretty much the same way, bottom boy. Like, I will... I'll do something else on the first day knowing there's going to be so many people out there. Like, I don't mind interacting with, with other people that are hunting or fishing. Like, hey, you know, do any good? See any deer today? Anything like that? But when there's so many and they're, like, actively... Like, I don't know. The uh, willingness to be entirely just non-courteous and rude of trout fishermen in PA. Like, if, I, if I'm walking down the creek looking for a spot and somebody's already fishing in a spot, I'm not going to stand right beside them or go across the creek and, and cast over their line. The willingness of people to do that in this state is amazing to me. That's gonna be... Oh, no way. I thought we had to mess that up. I got no idea, Mr. Biffin. Not a clue. I, they, they keep track of it in the stats. If I went and looked, I could find it. What's up, Nathaniel? Isn't that... Literally the minimum for the max weight estimate, 12.15. Straight through the lung. So now we have to find something good, right? 12 scoring red fogs usually mean good things. They do, Madway. They'll, they'll shut up like the night before turkey season starts. They know. Of course, Stoop uses an Orvis. You tell him. Which game do you prefer? Call of the Wild or Wave Hunter? I think Call of the Wild, like, in a vacuum, when you consider everything, I think it's Call of the Wild. The thing that does hurt Wave the Hunter, it, it has a little less replayability than Call of the Wild does. The, uh, the standardized scoring system, which Call of the Wild started with, but, you know, they, they've since gone to True Racks and stuff, and the new, the new scoring system generally. That hurts Way of the Hunter. And just like, I don't know if it's the lack of true racks or... You know, I, I think ultimately it's it's how limited the areas that you spend the vast majority of your time in are. And even Call of the Wild is limited because of, like, drink zones, generally. Need zones as a whole, but drink zones are really what make you go to the same spot over and over again. Way of the Hunter just kind of has that, but worse. Because their maps are bigger. I remember that... Uh, I, I talked to TK about it when, when Way the Hunter was first announced. 
I kind of... It didn't register to me how big whatever it was. 25 square miles or something was. And he told me it's something like two or two and a half times... Maybe it wasn't 25 square miles. 64 square kilometers or what... Call the Wilds maps are. It might have been 50 square miles. Whatever uh, Nez Perce's map size was. I didn't realize, but it's like two and a half times the size of Call of the Wild maps. So the thought was like, wow, that it's almost more content for, you know, whatever, twice the content for one and a half times the price, something like that. I remember having that conversation. But you only spend time in like 5% of it anyway. That's what really hurts Weight Honor, in my opinion. That was a horrible explanation, I'm sorry. What did you say, Reinhardt? <laughs> been scouting turkeys all week. Turkey mode has been engaged. I'm excited to get into turkey mode in a couple weeks in Kentucky. Should be a good time. I don't know if it'll be a killing time, but it should be a good time. Quinn, thank you so much for the super chat, by the way. Very much appreciate that. I'm perplexed as to what... Shouldn't that jump... I don't know why that didn't... Ma oh, now it did. Okay. Just took a while to update the overlay. Anyway, love your content. When is your hunting season end? Our red stag roar is just beginning here in New Zealand. Would you ever come over for it? All right, couple of questions there. So, like our deer season runs for, or our whitetail season, we'll just say, for sake of clarity, runs from, it's the first Saturday in October. Every now and then it's the last Saturday in September. Like if, it, if the first Saturday is like say the seventh, it'll be the last Saturday in September. Um, up until the middle of January. Our turkey season this year comes in May 4th. It'll run for, I think, four or five weeks, something like that. As for New Zealand, would I come over for it? I, I guess never say never. The logistics of traveling really far for hunting is not something I've I've conquered just yet. Should I airborne Canada moose? Holy! Oh, no way, Kelsey. Trolled by a leucistic bean goose? You know, here here's the proper way to deal with that. Every time you walk past that in your lodge, you just think of it as a big level four. Because that otherwise is just going to be painful. I can't believe that. They troll too, though. Like, both uh, Grey Lags and Bean Geese do troll a lot. Just had to be that one. That sucks. I I'm, uh, it's still a really cool kill. Like, huge, rare Bean Goose. Obviously a cool thing, but just could have been a little bit bigger. That certainly would have been nice. The pricey part is the plane ticket. I mean, there's just so much that goes into it, though. Like, are you better off bringing your own gun and I guess the risk the airline loses it and all that kind of stuff or are you better off like I know you can like rent rifles and stuff for for hunts like that because a lot of the hunts are on like club land and all that all that kind of stuff I just I don't even know where I'd begin anything good we got trolled by a can of the goose so call the wild played it's April Fool's joke on us Any more grams? We've only had it once. We've only made one gut shot thus far. What time is it? It's 11.55. Let's make it early morning again. More interesting things were happening when it was morning. Tips for best servers to find rares on multiplayer. See, I don't really like... I just kind of join a server I can get in and just hunt around, like... There's not a particular server I'm looking for. I just hunt whatever's active, like, in that time. So, for instance, if I join a server and it's 6 a.m. like we just made it here on Yukon, I'm going to check some grizzly bear spots, that kind of thing. So where else should we look for grizzlies? I'm trying to think where they might move to, because I know some of their zones have moved. Would they drink in the swamp? I doubt it, but I guess we can look. The pricey part is climbing mountain through straight brush will cost you your knees in the future. That's fair. Uh, he rented a gun but brought his own ammo, and the still and still the airports in different countries gave him a hard time about it. I could I could see that. That makes sense. If there's bison here, we'll definitely try to get them. Uh, yes, Anthony. I think they max at 69. I'm pretty sure.
Favorite key on your keyboard? All of them. I love all my keyboard key children equally. I wanted to shoot like a group, but they're moving. The time in the server selectoring doesn't work on console? Does it still not? That's crazy. It, that's been a thing since, what, like 2020? Maybe before that? You've been able to choose, like, what time the server you go in on PC. For a long time, anyway. Specs on the PC? I think it was just up there in the chat, a little bit above you. Getting on for my fellows, I'll let you know how it goes. Sounds good. Any rares? None so far, anyway. I'd like to get a rare today. I haven't had a, a Yukon rare in a bit. A rare bison would be cool. Is chocolate rare on fallow deer? Just uncommon. It's female, can't shoot that. Console doesn't have the ability? So I thought PS4 did. I know Xbox doesn't. Any uh, potentially interesting things? Just that, oh, there's a seven. Hope they attack. I'm gonna try to shoot a male, because we can't just shoot a female. I don't know where the six went though. Oh. Hey, wait a minute. This isn't fair, come back. No. This is a weird place to try to get a wolf. Uh-oh. Did we hit him or no? Nope. <laughs> I thought we could sneak that in there. All right, I gotta change that to 30 minutes now. Just when there was only 15 minutes to go. It was inevitable it was gonna happen again. Just shot a max weight albino whitetail. Nice. I wanted them to attack so bad I just sabotaged my own stream. Imagine that. Okay, how do I hit work off we go so now we got 38 minutes and still no attacking wolves either what are they chasing I guess bison I don't know there's there's nothing in here I just heard where's the dad hey you stay there this is your fault that could have been spinal cord <laughs> I hope it wasn't they all must die. Fur rarity should be stayed in the harvest screen would help new players. Yeah, I kind of get like why they don't just explicitly stay it. Like they, it's, uh, I get why they want the community to find that kind of stuff. Just some indication of like, even if, if it's like, hey, this isn't one of the common furs. Even if it's a, uh, a spirit brown bear that's just an uncommon. Just something to be like, oh, hey, this is something to pay attention to. Is level 7 red deer diamond? Level 9 for diamond red deer. Tries sprinting directly at them while screaming, weedle, weedle. Do they hate Pokemon or... Just got my 100th harvest. Wait, the hunter, the flint... Wait, the hunter? The flinter bow and my 100th harvest for coyote. Oh, with the flinter bow. Goodness gracious. You'd think I could figure that out. Sorry. Uh, and my 100th harvest for coyote was an albino. Nice. Albino coyotes are cool. I want another one. I don't know if I have one in the lodge. I've killed a couple over the years, but I, I think all pre-trophy lodges. Who remembers light gray scrub hair as a rare? Yeah, right? I thought I had a light gray scrub hair diamond, but I have a gray. Sounds good, Shio. Appreciate you hanging out. Hopefully that goes well. As a man that is part of the... What does that mean? Something lifestyle noise cancellation should be only good for number one for me? Does that stand for... Uh, deer in... Nashville... Crab. Crusty grab. I don't know. Dull income, no kids. Yeah, I definitely didn't know that's what that meant. <laughs> Dull income, no kids. 
Dull income is... I guess most jobs, actually. Close. <laughs> Close again, but we're good. Probably gonna be another five in here. I don't really do, like, I'd probably never hunt this area of my Yukon, so for all I know, there are diamond or rare geese around here. I wish rare geese were more obvious, because the brown hybrids kind of look like all the rares. Like, light gray leucistic sort of looks like brown hybrid, gray sort of looks like brown hybrid, at least from underneath when they're flying over you. Big male! Oh, we got the heart shot with the scope, I see. Hey, Space Cowboy. We are just running around uh, with a couple of rules in place. We've we've had uh, two misses. So the stream's been extended 30 minutes. You can see it in the bottom right. We've not shot a female yet by accident. Uh, Non-vital hits, we had one. No organs hit maybe three times. So it's been a good little mix. It's, it's not been as if we're missing everything. But there's been enough that we've extended the stream and all that kind of stuff. Like, how does that make sense? It was a little further with open sights, and the bullet got to, like, here? That's one of the things I don't quite understand about this game. Like, sometimes, Bison, Cape Buffalo, you, you just see such differences in ammo performance that you wonder what is bugged. Is it the ammo? Is it the harvest screen? Is it both? I hope not, ZBG. Classics British Columbia is red for their falls, and it's a hundred times better. I really hope that's not what they were trying to do. Mel's gonna get the Diamond Mountain Hair that's the Easter Bunny. It would have been really funny if that Easter Bunny I spotted in yesterday's video was a diamond. I thought it was a rare at first. It looked funny. I went to go track it, and then I spotted it, and it was normal. And then, boom. Black grouse I needed for the two animals, one shot. Your bug? It's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. I think you might be right, Ian. What's up, Uri? Uh, honestly, you wish Call the Wild had more zeroing ranges? I guess things get overly complicated if you, you know... Oh god, diamond at, uh... 200 meters, I gotta hurry up and change my zeroing, and, and you gotta go through, like, 10 of them? Like, kinda how Way the Hunter has? Although, with Way the Hunter, you can choose to go up or down in the zeroing. Yeah, I don't know. In those panic moments, though, it's good to only have three. What, Andrew? That's crazy. Do a girl voice? I don't I don't think I have a girl voice. I can do an old man, though. Uh, I'll tell you what. Brother just tuned into his first stream. It is a chaotic one, but I appreciate him tuning in. There's a wolf. Yeah, friends. Will you attack? Will your friends attack? What's wrong with that shot? Oh man. <laughs> what could have possibly happened? At least we hit him. Tree? No, nah, I think we hit him. Maybe I hit the tree. He reacted though. I think. That's what I'm talking about. You can't tell. Brown hybrid, I'm pretty sure. Just came back, what I missed? Um, a whole lot of trying to get wolves to attack and not succeeding. Yeah, he's dying. It's another one. I swear, okay, he moved a little bit when we shot. Needs helium for a girl voice? What am I, I if I remember right, I'm pretty sure it was my friend's little brother. At some kind, I really can't remember. It might have been a, a birthday party or something at their house. He inhaled so much helium that he passed out along, like, the side of the house outside. <laughs> it wasn't for too long. Maybe so, Tacos. The good thing is the most of the shots that have been bad have only been bad in the sense that it's, like, the no sights or the old man flantro thing. I'm curious with this wolf, because if that was a spinal cord shot, that's non-vital. It says no organs hit. We'll see where we hit him. Uh, 
That one was fine. And he should be dead because he was running around in circles here. I hear aggressive wolf. So... Can't shoot the females. If they kill us, I forget what reset has to happen. But we had... Do they flee? You know, I, I asked for one aggressive wolf. I'll take it. I forget what happens if if the if a wolf kills us. There was a rule that we made up that now has slipped in my mind. I about need my blood out for this. That says he's going that way. That says he's going that way. That kind of could make sense. You did only ask for one? Yeah, I did it to myself. Wish and call it the wild or way the hunter. You could, you could, what does that say? You mean, does that mean remove a species, Reinhardt? So what was this? Okay. It said no organs hit. But we're going to count that as non-vital. I don't even know if I can do three minutes. But we we kind of agreed earlier that was m meant to be non-vital. So... Where's the thing? Let it restart. Where is Gamps? Who's Gamps? I don't know. i tell you what. Kids in this generation, they, they don't have no respect. I, I have a name. It's Jebediah the Twelfth. My father and his father and his father and his father. Where am I? Who am I? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go to the grocery store and pick up some... Bread and milk uh, necessities to get off my lawn. Great Joe Biden impression. Uh, that's a fact, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> you know the thing. <laughs> Is that so gummy? <laughs> what was the war like with the British? Well. They don't teach you this in the history books, but kinda easy. You just threw a can of beans and they sort of all attacked it like a pack of rabid wolves and you ran away. I, I don't know. Yeah, back in my day, we didn't use scopes, just the force. <laughs> Losing my voice. Yeah, well, you know, a little uh, tuberculosis, that's not the word. <laughs> What's that thing where you can't talk? <laughs> I don't remember. What, nurse's home? I don't need no nursing home. I live alone. Cut my own firewood. Fall asleep at night under the stars. How was having polio? Isn't that what the kids say for cool now? Does old man Flandro say horn or antler? All deer have horns. Antlers are made up. That's what 30 years of Marlboro Silvers will do to you kids. I started smoking when I was nine years old. My pappy said it would put hair on my chest. All it did was put a hole in my neck. Don't do drugs, kids. Stay in school. Rheumatoid arthritis? I haven't seen my palm in 30 years. Oh, hey, the timer's up. A Biden impression is politics, not if it's apolitical. If I have one more non-vital hit, I'm not going to make it through the rest of the stream. <laughs> I, was, I was running out of, out of volume in my voice real fast. Keep going, Flunter Biden. Yeah, anyway. Grandpa God, no! It's unfortunate that everybody would rather fl <laughs> Grandpa Flantro than 
<laughs> Sound like an old Bill Clinton? I, I don't know when, like, that happened at the beginning of the stream when I started doing the old man impression. It doesn't usually turn into Bill Clinton, but it did today. Poor vocal cords, I know. It's bad. I, I really am the wrong person to ask Alex. What I would do is look in the, um, the trophy gallery in the Angler Discord. Just, like, whatever diamond species you want to go after, just search that and images will come up and people will typically like post a picture of where they caught it and what you also want to look at is the water temperature in the screenshot so the screenshot that shows you know the weight and the how long it took to retrieve it and all that kind of stuff that'll show the water temperature water temperature is i guess next to location like the biggest factor the size of the hook you use and all that kind of stuff it really is irrelevant unless you use too big of a hook like you pretty much can't have too small of a hook like, I caught my diamond tiger fish in early access, which still remains to be the biggest diamond tiger fish that's at least been posted anywhere. Um, on a size 5 popper, which you can catch like 3 pound bronzes on that thing or juveniles. Have I mentioned my voice hurts? Oh, come on. What happened there? <laughs> oh, no. That better not be... If that's vertebrae again, I'm in trouble. I, I have not had time to recover from that. At least we hit it. Old man Flantro's running for president. That's funny. I can't remember what I had. Maybe that was for April Fool's. I had some idea where I was going to do some kind of political thing as a joke. I don't know if it was going to be old man Flantro. I can't remember. I am getting old, darn it. <laughs> I had some kind of thing where I was going to be like, as a joke, like, you know, this video is sponsored by Shadow's campaign to run for president or something like that, but I can't remember what. If a voice actor job comes up for a backwoods grandpa, you're a shoo -in. <laughs> So he's not dead yet, which would kind of imply we may have hit um, like shoulder blade or something. Pulling uh, Brandon Herrera. Is it like, I know he's like running for office or whatever. Or did, is he doing well with any of that? I have no idea what's going on. Will you play the Hunter Classic? Tomorrow's video is going to be classic and Wednesday night, 7.30 p.m. Eastern. I stream classic every Wednesday at that time on Twitch. Shadow should run for the Ponk Zatani fill position. I think she could effectively be a groundhog. I'm really concerned. Now that he's dead, I think we hit him in the vertebrae. If I gotta do that again so quick. He's in a runoff now. Really? Wow. I didn't, I didn't realize it was that uh, going that well. What's wrong with Shadow? We don't know exactly what it is, but we think it's something called limber tail, which is like from either like overexertion run around or it's almost like a sprained like ligament or whatever. Uh, I noticed last night, like, so we, we had her at my parents all day yesterday for um, Easter and she just, she loves she loves going over there. She loves, like, my, my parents, siblings, everybody. She just, like, runs around like a nut. Plus, we had that Easter egg I talked about, so she was running around outside a bunch. And we're kind of guessing it just happened from that. Because apparently, like, a lot of exercise, a lot of playing around can cause it. So I noticed last night she was just, like, stirring around in bed a lot. She couldn't get comfortable, and I was like, something's wrong with her. But you never know. She Sometimes she's up all night chewing her bone and stuff, so I didn't think too much of it. Took her out at 6 o'clock this morning, and she was walking funny. And what I actually thought happened was she had pooped and didn't... Not all the poop was on the ground, I guess. So I was like, well, you're not getting back in bed. So, like, I tried to lift her tail to see what was going on, and she yelped. And I was like, well, something's wrong with her tail. And, yeah, we think it's that. So she's... She's been sleeping most of the day. I gave her a CBD treat to hopefully help with that. It looks like rest is the main thing for it. But yeah, she sprained her tail because she loves you so much, apparently so. Um, if, if she doesn't show any improvement, we're going to have to take her to the bed. But I'm 
pretty confident that's what that is. Like, the longer it's been throughout the day, that just adds up more and more seeing her behavior and stuff. She's still... If you get a treat for her or food or anything, she's still very much interested in that. So it's not as if she's like, you know, a different dog, if you know what I mean. All right. Was this vertebrae? Dang it. All right. Here we go again. I tell you what, in my old age, I, I can't see through the scope anymore. And just shoot it brown and... Yeah, you know, like they say, if it's brown, it's down. Speaking of brown, took him to the Super Bowl. Uh, sorry. Try icing it? I don't know if she'd let me do that. Did you know that you can ice the kicker in the footballs? Back in my day, you didn't have time to watch football. You had to... Milk the cows and get the chickens from the eggs, or the eggs from the chickens. And, you know, if they misbehave, cut their heads off. Tell us about your first truck. Well, I had a 1937 F100. That truck, they don't make them like that no more. I, tell, I had 800,000 miles. And, uh, I think it was that newfangled gas that just, it ruined the engine, and I, I just, I hated to part with that thing. It drove me around, herding cattle, shot my first buck back in 1941, it was a spike, as was my second buck. And my third buck. We didn't have deer. Oh, these newfangled shows with their 200 inch, non typical. That wasn't. That's not hunting. I tell you, it's different. I miss it. 1941, yes, sir. Back when you were just an afterthought or a before thought. I don't know. Did you go to school? Well, you know, I skipped school a lot to go hunting, shooting squirrels and chipmunks. And I'd bring them home. Mama would tell me to get them out of the house. I'd have to skin them and out at the woodshed, hang the pelt, make gloves out of them. Why does he sound 83 years old? I, I'm 82. Gosh, the lack of respect. Is this a redeem? It's because I'm bad at shooting. There you go. Read it for yourself. You probably need to practice reading kids these days with their cell phones on the face tube and the... What's that new thing? W? Changed that bird app to one letter. Elon Musk. Do you need a new drink? No. Do you? <laughs> People who just joined. I, I was going to do five minutes. Thank goodness I didn't. Voice could not handle it. But my thought was if I did five minutes, there would be so much more confusion. If he's 82, he wasn't born until 1941, yet he shot his first buck in 1941. I didn't, I didn't do a lot of math there. Grandpa would be really not proud of me though, because back in his day they did reading, writing, and arithmetic. What did Danny say? Oh, what if, what if he uses his voice for the vowels? <laughs> ah, Flantro. Solemnly declare, wait, that's something else. Ready for the White House? Yeah, I've reached the age where I can Get elected. I'd love to see an IRL hunting vid from you that's a self-made bow hunt. I have been doing that for about five years. I've got a playlist of IRL hunting on the channel. You can look it up. Uh, I've probably shot on camera, let me think, with a bow. One my first year in 2019, three in 2020 all does, 
One in 2021. I didn't even count. One, three, five. Uh, one in 22, that was a buck. So I think I've killed six with a bow. Because I didn't get any this past year with a bow. I've heard some about it, Ian. I don't, I don't know the whole thing. Make some grandpa shorts? Oh, boy. <laughs> Nobody's going to know what's going on if they click on them. Where's all of our bears? We had a roaring population of bears when I was a boy. Like, oh, like a self-made bow. I misunderstood. I don't know if I... I, I wouldn't have the, the confidence to take that hunting. Can we get a Gramps IRL hunting video? An IRL one. What am I going to do, like, put on a, one of them fake Santa beards and <laughs> do a Duck Dynasty impression? Do the Grant voice when, when you find the next great one? I don't even know how, how do you react with a great one uh, with a grandpa voice? Nice, Ender. This is not an April Fool's joke, I take it. At 12, 12, 12 p.m. I think it's going to be after 12, 12, 12 p.m. Because it's supposed to be like not long before sunset, I think. Old Man DD 33 Oh, boy. Holy. <laughs> Is that Old Man DD? I've been hunting this boy for decades. What's the average for Great One Whitetail kills? I think it's something like 1,500, but I don't know for sure. Oh no, we missed it. How did I hit that high? Dang it, man. <laughs> I was so sure that was going to be fine. Did I aim over top of it? I guess so. We got 12 minutes away from the ending and then whiffed again. So now... Now we got 28 minutes. Holy, a great one faints. I need my inhaler. Nice, Mason. I finally get good non iPhone videos in months. There you go. Is that a mirrorless camera? I don't know enough about. I'm assuming. Oh, actually, Canon makes camcorders, huh? All right, that's actually 300 meters. If we miss again, I'm going to be kind of annoyed because I don't even know what happened the first time. That looks a little more like it. Uh. No? That might have been a gut shot. What even is gut shot? It's been so long. Gut shot is. Oh yeah, it's it's old man Flantro. <laughs> I guess I've been so used to the vertebrae, I don't even know what it was. I'm perplexed as to what's happening with these shots because I didn't think anything was wrong with that one either. Make this a non-stop stream. <laughs> We're working on it. Why is I didn't even realize old man Flantro timer was still up there. How did it get up there? I didn't find one. I saw at least like 15 buck bents and I didn't find one either. So after the stream, assuming the stream ever ends, my plan is to go back and try again, basically. Gramps needs some new optical. I might need another drink if I got to do it again. I hear elk call. Probably. It's a camcorder. If I get good turkey videos, I'm shamelessly super chatting a link to my channel. <laughs> okay, he's dead, so let's see what happened. Kyla does old lady Kyla and we fight like an old married couple. I don't even know, like, I'm not even sure how we would do that. You said you were making dinner. I have to have a movie dinner. I'm 89 years old. 
You think this process nonsense isn't gonna give me a heart attack? You want me gone, woman, I know it. That was non-vital, son of a gun. <laughs> All right, here we go again. I've only gotten worse as the stream goes on. What even is the stream? Back in my day, he went fishing in his stream. Now well, these kids, they want to be streamers when they grow up. You no know, firefighters or you know, lumberjacks or uh, politicians. I don't grow up to be a politician. They're all liars. Speaking of liars. Oh, I thought I missed that one too. If you keep killing all these big males, you're going to give me a heart attack. Just trying to get rid of me for the life insurance. This is beginning to hurt my stomach as well. Let Grandpa miss the shot. I haven't missed since. Well, he trained me to be a sniper in World War 14. Or with a mini 14 in World War. How did that go again? Uh, anyway. I don't miss. Sometimes they move, but I don't miss. <laughs> Chase the fox, thinking it's your dog from years ago. Rover! Is that you, boy? I thought you got hit by that guy in the Model T. <laughs> oh, I'm too old for this. Leave me alone. The Alzheimer's is kicking in. I'll kick it back. You can't stop me. Gramps was a college dropout. I didn't go to college. I ran out of high school. I had started working at the steel mill, inhaling hepatitis or uh, <laughs> what's that? Mesothelioma. What's the thing? <laughs> I can't remember. Tell us about the time you were hunting the chupacabra. I had a pet chupacabra. It was a yippy little thing. I still can't think of what causes me so th Asbestos, that's the one. Yeah. If he's not careful, his voice will get stuck that way. It's like uh, Bell's palsy, but for the impressionists. Be working in the coal mines, not the steel mill. I don't remember her no more. I'm pretty sure when I was 19, they had me doing the grunt work, and I was inhaling asbestos like these kids inhale their vapes. And, and well, look how I turned out. Hey, it's been three minutes. Why do anti-sickness tablets take, taste so gross? Because they have to uh, gross out the sickness. Any trophies so far? We got a uh, troll goose. April Fool's is in full effect. Bell's palsy, but not asbestos. I seriously couldn't think of the word. That wasn't that wasn't the bit. I actually couldn't think of what it's called. It's actually hurting my stomach because I like inhale a lot to do that. I can't risk missing again. Wow, was 334 not the minimum on that? You'd think it would be a rare or something to have an SML like that. Well, we'll go over here. What's going on, Uriah? Do a video with that voice with Scarecrow and call it Grumpy Old Man Hunting Edition. Does Scarecrow do an old man impression? Old Man Flandro is weak sauce. Boy, I, you have no idea what I'm capable of. You Canadians up there, sorry, I, I could kick your sorry ace, that's for sure. <laughs> What's up, Zaggy? You know, I almost did, like, something like EW just released a great one, something stupid, like great one Mallard and we're hunting for it. 
but I thought of you doing the mountain lion thing back in the day, and to my recollection, EW had a lot of comments for a long time, so I decided not to do a fake release. Your poor ace, that's right. You gotta be concerned. Cherry flavored pain meds? I, I, yeah, cherry's pretty bad. I don't remember what it was, but when I was a kid, I had cherry something and it made me throw up immediately. I like actively avoid it at this point. Please tell me I was alone. Okay. Thank goodness. As a Canadian, I'll say this, I'm bigger than you, I'm higher on the food chain. <laughs> Until you see my flying back kick to the throat, you won't be saying that no more. <laughs> Two broken jaws and the worst part of the second one was the cherry flavor? Oh no. <laughs> Clark's a honey badger. Holy. What's up, Xander? As it stands, unless we miss any more shots, we have 15 more minutes of the stream. Every shot is a 15 minute stream extension. I figured it would be right about like three misses. That, that was my guess. We've missed three. We have 19 minutes to go. I can't do a Trump impression. I've tried, I can't do it. Should really stop just going for stuff like that. Hate anything grape flavor these days because it all reminds me of the taste of chewable children's Advil. I also don't like grape flavored stuff. Grape flavored like Jolly Ranchers or whatever, fine. Uh, I don't mind them. But medicine, yeah, I, it's not quite as bad for cherry. It doesn't, it doesn't have that attached, like, I guess memory of throwing up, so it doesn't make me as sick. But it's, it's sure not good. Yeah, K-Flow, I'd imagine that's something we gotta worry about. Only because you refused to unload a bag at that goose like you would have had there not been consequences. I'm watching the stream under protest. I'm gonna start doing things to make you watch under protest more then. Cherry Robitussin? I think that's what it was. I'm pretty sure. I was pretty little, but that's what I would seem to remember it being. Guess we're going around. How dare you make me protest more? I'll do what I want. There was a medicine I used to love the taste of? I don't remember any medicines I liked. There was something my brother liked, though. I, I don't know what it was, but I do remember him having... It was a medicine I hated, but he thought it was good. What's the April Fool's thing? Uh, as far as this particular stream goes, it's... um. Here, hold on, I'll do it again. Take your time. April Fool's! To me! Ah! <laughs> so, yeah, um... It's hard to do an April Fool's stream, and April Fool's happened to fall on a stream day. So we've got a little list of rules here. And thus far, I don't know how many times we've had no organs hit. Maybe three? We've missed three shots that have caused 45 additional minutes, which you can see in the bottom right. And I think at least four times we've had non-vital hits. We've done a good bit of Grandpa Flandro today. Your husband thinks Pepto tastes good? I don't, like, hate it. Kyla hates it. I will throw up in some. But I don't think it tastes good by any stretch. Where have we not been that we should go? What about, I want to go to, like, caribou places, potentially. Try this lake. Hey, Jane, thank you for subscribing. What about? Grape flavored Tylenol dissolves. I don't know if I've ever had dissolving Tylenol, maybe when I was a kid. You're a caribou? Thank you. Does Grandpa Flantro like Werther's? Well, the wife keeps them in a bowl on the counter. 
I think she bought them 15 years ago. And I, every morning I grab one on my way to the woodshed. I'm so immature. Every time the Pepto commercial comes on, I can't help but giggle as they dance. As at the dance they do while they're saying diarrhea. Is that the, um, the workout one? The voices? Do you really, David? <laughs> I don't think they're Werther's, but there's something... Is Werther's Butterscotch? Is that right? I think so. They're they're like some off-brand thing, but my mom has Werther's uh, on the little like... Kitchen counter thing. It's not a counter. It's, it's actually like a... It's like a set of cupboards on wheels kind of that then also has a little counter table thing. Anyway. In hunting season, before I go hunting, I almost always grab one. And like 30% of the time, my dad, like, I'll walk past him and he'll be like, Hey, wait a second, look at me. And I'll look at him. And he's like, Do you have like a knot on the side of your face? I'm like, dude, I've got a butterscotch thing. And do you think I got, do you think Kyla knocked me out earlier? <laughs> oh, do you mean SpongeBob, Mel? I love medicines that have more and worse side effects than what you're trying to get rid of. Dude, when they do those commercials and it's like... I realize probably on the severe end of the cases it's worse than they make it sound, but when it when it's some like non-life-threatening thing and the medicine's like, yeah, there's 15 different ways you might want to commit suicide and they're, it's probably going to make you really sick for the rest of your life, but it'll get rid of that pain in your elbow you have. Is that what it was? Yes. I'm not going to play it. Not like I won't replay it. I played it at the beginning of the stream and then like a little bit ago, obviously. Um, I don't want to get copyright struck by Nickelodeon, but I said at the beginning, like, don't copyright strike me. It's just, it's out of appreciation. Just shot a diamond goose. Nice. Kyla seems like a slugger. I don't, I was just thinking that one time, like, I, she walked, she was walking out of the room and I stuck my hand out for a high five and she did, like, a really loud high five and I went, ow, don't hit me. <laughs> DMCA stream, imagine. I mean, I don't turn ads on, like, after the streams anyway. Like, for the VODs. So I guess it probably wouldn't really matter, but. Where be this bear? What do we got? 13 minutes? Unless I miss, which the way we're going, you never know. <laughs> That's what we're looking for, Zoop. <laughs> Great brown, not that big. Had it been albino, we'd obviously chase it to the ends of the earth, but no worries. There's no caribou here. I don't caribou what they think. Uh, where are their caribou? Down here, maybe? Uh, Reels, thank you for the 38 months, by the way. Forgot I had this to use, just gonna shout out Ryzen for the win. Hey, I appreciate it, man. Appreciate the long standing membership. You miss again at 12 minutes? I mean, it, it's about that time I've been doing it. Guaranteed troll piebald blacktail. Well, that is not kind. Literally, like, there's something going on today. There, the game is just April Foolsing almost everybody. We had a troll goose. A couple people had trolls in here earlier. Someone else had a troll super rare uh, bean goose. Care about care about, I, I see what you're saying. I get it. I have an elk question. How active are elk in early July? I'm planning a camping trip to Benazet and wondering how likely it is that we'll see many elk. I would imagine they're pretty active. Like, I, I don't know enough about them. Like, we don't have them close enough to hear where I encounter them very often, just when I go up that way. Um... And I've only ever been up there in the fall, but I've never gone up there and not seen them. Like, they, like 30 in someone's yard, stuff like that. I've never seen a big bull up that way, but... Well, other than in the elk pens, there was one in there. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, just going squirrel hunting on public, there was a herd of cows that went running by with collars on, like tracking collars. I, I would be shocked if you don't encounter them up there. 
I saw it, my eyes glue up, and I looked at the score estimate. Man, Max is at 168? That just ain't fair. <laughs> when they're guaranteed trolls like that. I mean, I guess maybe it's better than not being a guaranteed troll and then trolling you. I don't know. Kyla trolled you by killing that non-tip? She trolled me, too. I've, I mean, you know this. I've killed so many Whitetail in the game. Kyla probably has... What do you, How many hours do you have in Classic in the last year? 20? <laughs> Since the last April Fool's event. Like, once that ends... I don't know. You probably played maybe 20 hours of Halloween. Maybe 50 hours. I probably not even that many. 363 non-tip Whitetail. For those that don't play Classic, that's like not playing the game for a year of Call of the Wild and coming back and getting like back to back to back great ones or something crazy like that. Like it's one or two in the entire classic community get killed every couple months. Had an albino troll moose the other day that maxed at 256. Oh man. I might have seen that. I I think I saw did you post that in Discord? I seem to recall seeing a, a troll moose that had a really low estimate. Like, there's just places animals don't exist. I guess we'll go kill some bikes or something. It, it's really weird today. It just doesn't happen, okay? <laughs> it's not possible. Oh no, ruined a diamond hog gear with a 308. That'll do it. There's gotta be bison here. Unless they're spawned like where we're at? Kind of looks like that might be the case. What is your favorite non-hunting game? Like ever or... I guess at present, I mean I've been playing a good bit of the angler, that's been fun. I feel like that's in the same general genre though, like outdoor game anyway. Uh, I've had quite a lot of fun with Pokemon Brilliant Diamond on my Switch, that's been fun. Uh, I played Subnautica for like two weeks there, just a ton. And then I sort of beat the game again. And I'm like, okay, I'll pick it up again in a couple years when I need that experience again. Is past caribou drink time? Uh, just the very end of it though, right? Are, are, do they drink till eight or nine? Uh, we had a zone up here. Oh, still eight. I thought it was still nine still. Whoops, that would explain a lot. There they are. If you're not a member, can you be in the Discord? Yeah. It's uh, open to the public. Unless you're Soup, he's not allowed in there. Aggressive. Not dying. No, we got him. Okay. Still good. Do you know what the new April Fool's event is for Classic? Yes. I don't know if... Are you asking me to tell you what it is, or are you just asking if I know it? Not allowed to Discord? Nope. Not allowed. No soup sign on the door? It says... No soup beyond this point. Just tune in and what big or small males have you gotten? Uh, we had a troll Canada goose. That was the main thing. So um, if you if you saw the title there, I'll throw the rules up again because I made the graphic. I might as well use it. Um, each missed shot adds 15 minutes of the stream. This goose was flying around us. I spent a long time like, just land. Just please land. And it, it looked like they were going to land and they, they were spooking off or something weird. It was strange the way they were behaving. So I, I it's level five. I got to try to get it. So I shot it out of the air. I missed the first shot, hit the second one. So they, it cost me 15 minutes. The reason that the first miss we had at the stream was that. Um, missed a couple things since. All that, like, stress and trying to make the shot and not miss 12 times so I wasn't streaming the rest of my life. Only to have him troll. It was a little bit unfortunate. How funny would it be if he just fires off around by accident? I've done it plenty of times. It's amazing I haven't yet. You don't know what it is? Okay, anybody that doesn't want it to have it spoiled, I guess you can cover your ears for a second. So they're called blocktail deer. They're, I guess what you'd imagine if Minecraft were to make deer. They're square deer. 
not much of a challenge for you because you basically never miss? Well, we missed three times, so we've had 45 minutes of stream extension. We've had at least four non-vital hits because I've had to do the old man impression for at least a total of 12 minutes today. And I think I had two or three no organs hit, which meant we had to use no sights. That never actually ended up costing us. I can't shoot you because no females today. I'm kind of amazed we haven't clipped a random doe or cow, whatever, just yet. Could still happen. White tail blocks, black tail. Do it. Box the moose. <laughs> Too bad there is no punching animation. Couple of relatively unimpressive boysen. Down to five minutes. If we can. Well, I sort of wanted the wolves. We're gonna see if they'll attack instead. Yeah, dude, we, we decided that if we were to find a rare female, I just have to shoot it and, like, that's just how it's going to work. We'll have to accept the consequences. It seems unfair to be like, well, I'm just not going to shoot it. So, if one were to show up in the next five minutes, we got to shoot it. Just Yukon, Chris. At this point, there's only a couple minutes left in the stream unless we miss a shot again, which could certainly happen because I'm probably going to shoot one of these wolves on the trot or shoot at If it would... Where did the mail go? There it is. Were there only two? No, don't do that. That's, that's cheating. Smoked. Oh, there were more. I don't know how they got on my sight, but... Got a four. It's a seven. Guaranteed troll mellow fallow only goes up to 240. What's the, what's with the super troll today? I swear April Fools is in full effect in Call of the Wild. If there was punching in Call of the Wild, how many people would kill a great one by punching it? That would definitely be something that would have been done by now. When did you shoot your first buck in real life? 2007. Hey, congrats on yours, man. What's up, Rattle? 442. We're gonna fast travel somewhere, try to get, I guess, one more kill. And unless we oof the shot. Where a bison drink? There's some up here now. <laughs> Is that right, Soup? So there should be, they drink all the way around, not all the way around, but like way up here. So we should have plenty of room to go and look for them. Favorite trophy in Call of the Wild? Probably the Pieball Diamond Gray Fox we got back a uh, couple weeks after Mississippi release. Matt would have been the first to get a TKO on a great one moose. Have you ever gone mule deer hunting? No, it's something I'd like to do. I have, uh, I gotta get more this year, but I have, I don't know, four or five preference points for Wyoming deer, but the plan that I've had for a while, because I've got elk, deer, and pronghorn preference points out there. The plan is go pronghorn hunting, make it a however long, week, two week trip. Ideally, get a pronghorn early in that trip and do some scouting for future mule deer hunting. Then whenever, get a mule deer tag, go out. Maybe that's a three week trip, I don't know. Ideally, fill the tag early-ish and do some scouting for elk and then do an elk hunt after that. That's how I'd like that to go. I don't know if that's how it will go. Yesterday was the six year anniversary. Was it really? That's crazy, dude. What was it? Was he 301? It was it was a or 314, 313, something like that. It was a lower 300s, right? But piebald non-tip. If you guys look at Madwee's uh, profile photo, I think with the longbow in classic. 325? Oh, it's higher than I thought then. My biggest is only 329. 
The fact that you've got a super rare four below that's pretty wild. There's a mail. Scored, wow, 248.45. So what is he, one and a half shy? That's crazy. Why couldn't the game have just been a little kinder? Should be vitals. Good deal. It is 445, so I think we're safe. Unless we get attacked by wolves. And we don't even have anything to go back to the trophy lodge for because the goose and Call the Wild and its April Fool's way decided to get us. Never knew Nevada had moose. I don't know if I knew that or not. That missed, you missed, you missed. Bad at the game. Got my fallow great one last June, trying to get my whitetail and black bear before the year's up. That'd be neat to be able to, to get all five in a year. Quick classic, ever since I came back, all my progress got reset. Have you definitely logged into the same account? I'm not aware of that ever happening in classic. Your entire life is a miss? Oof. That's pretty cool, Nevada. Battleship stream at every miss adds 15 minutes. That might have been vertebrae. Nope. We're in the clear. Hey, thank you, Cole. Sounds good, JTAC. Appreciate you hanging out. Have wolves coming in more so, too? Well, suppose that kind of makes sense, but... Are they... I don't know if you're still in that field or still connected to that kind of stuff. Are they a big, uh, like, threat to other species? In the numbers that are there now? What kind of rifle do you have? The, my real-life deer gun? It's a Weatherby Vanguard 7mm-8. If I stumble across one cool but no way I'm setting up another great one grind, it moose beat me like a rented mule. <laughs> At least you have them all right, right now, right? All five? There's a lot of bison down here now. You use a 243? That's what I started with. Our, uh, my brother and I's first gun, my dad got us a... I forget the exact name of it, but it's a Rossi, like... It's some kind of combo thing because it has three different barrels. It's a 410, 22, and 243 barrel. And uh, after a while, we just kept the 243 barrel on it. But it was a, a good first gun for us. We killed a number of squirrels with the 410 barrel, a couple of groundhogs with the 22, and I think we both got our first buck with it. I only killed two deer with it. Because then, like, we started hunting on our own. I think when I was 13, I started hunting on my own, so my brother would have the. 243 with my dad and I would take the old 3030 by myself. What's going on, Wyatt? I guess I can remove the stream extension thing because we're kind of past that now. We chased the elk down a lot of years of hard winters, but we don't have the problem that Montana, Idaho, and Wyoming have. Yeah, that's that was sort of my guess. If you guys didn't have a huge population of them, so that makes sense. Got one of them Minecraft bucks. That's, I think, what I'm about to go and do. I'm probably going to make dinner. I don't even know what we're going to have. Oh, no, it's Easter leftovers. That'll be easy. And then I got to try to record a video on that. I attempted to record it before the stream. Didn't find a single one. I probably saw 15 or 20 blacktail. No such luck. So what I'll likely do is... No. What I'll... <laughs> Kyla's going to kill my big knots if she's not allowed on my servers <laughs> now. I'm probably going to... Like, maybe sit in a tree stand while I make dinner or something so that I can have a chance of getting one that way. And then if I can, you know, get one or two like that. They, they're more rare than I thought they were going to be. So I'm thinking I'm going to need to do multiple sessions to get a video out of them. Like anime, am I reading that correctly? Thank you for subscribing. Shoot them, don't miss. I would never miss. 
Anything good today? We had a level 5 Canada Goose that sadly trolled us. You will not see much of the block tails on multiplayer. Wait. Why multiplayer? Maybe I need to be in single player. No Kyla's on the server? Not allowed. One forty nine, that's one of the better ones I've seen. I'm waiting to see why Reinhardt says the multiplayer thing. Maybe I need to be in single player, a gamer's breakup line. <laughs> Maybe I gotta go back to single player for a little while, man. Just found what appears to be a piebald block tail. There you go. What map we're on Yukon Valley? Yeah, I was going to use that as leverage at some point. <laughs> my bow is the reason that spawned, obviously. Like, right, that's, right. you know, I got my 365 not to hit mule deer with it. It's just, it's, the bow does it. Uh, no, I killed it with a cap lock, actually. Never mind. I had my bow at some point. So those non zip horns are great. Did you empty your clip taking it down? <laughs> Kind of more interested in the fox. Single player is best because it's just you on there, but multiplayer, everyone's shooting them and you'll not see them. Oh, I see what you're saying. I mean, I just I just do like a password to multiplayer server when I record. Ever since the, the hunt for the 200 typical whitetail, I started putting the pieces together over the years of like, I had killed all of my trophy whitetail in multiplayer. Every 190 plus I've ever killed has been multiplayer. So I pretty much just record in multiplayer now. Just passworded server, like, I just mash my keyboard and make some kind of random password that's unguessable. That way Kyla can't come in and shoot my rares. Why are you such a hater? <laughs> that wasn't bad. Glutton for punishment, all my trophies are off my own map. It takes effort. Back from taking B out to play, kids have sick, but he still has to go outside for a little bit each day. Hey, that's a that's a good thing though that he wants to go outside. DM you the password next time. You and Kyler are gonna fight to try to get in my server and kill my cool things. At this point, I'm gonna just stream till five because that's the normal end time anyway. So we got eight minutes to ruin this and have to stream for longer. Hello? Can I have my gun, please? Hello? <laughs> Had to hit it 15 times. Did you shoot something yet? No. I like how Nightbot just needs it, like, the Nightbot takes 12 years to do things. That's the unfortunate part. Casual hunt on Quattro. We'll see. I was saying earlier, like, ever since doing the Red Deer grind on Quattro, that was like 50, it was either 54 or 6, 5600 kills? I think 5400 kills. Uh, it's just, you know, it's one of them things where I go back to Quattro and I'm just kind of like, eh. Kind of, kind of spent a lot of time here. Big meal. Who's trying his best? My gun? Ooh, hosting a multiplayer server one time. Someone got a 300 plus non-tip. Trying to think. Somebody killed like a 270s piebald Rosie off my map years ago. Actually, I've had a 192 piebald mule deer killed off my map. Back-to-back -back servers. People killed albino wolves on my map on Timbergold. What else? I don't know if anyone's ever killed like a crazy... Like, you know, that. 300 plus non-tip, 200 typical whitetail, that kind of thing. I can't recall anything like that. Oh, you knew who it was? That's kind of better then. Like, the, the things I was talking about, all those different things I just listed off, that was me hosting, like, four subscribers and stuff, so, you know, I was in no way, like, upset that they got them. Didn't someone shoot a big mellow whitetail with you? Yeah, um, Cameron. I don't know what his name was in the game. I'm still friends with him on Facebook. He kills big males. Think might be in one of the Carolinas. He's in one of the southern states. But anyway. 
Uh, that, I don't, that could have been my server, I can't remember. But he found it, and I was, you know, doing YouTube at the time. So I was like, I just asked if I could come over and record it. So he had, he had called it in, he was sitting in a tree stand, let it walk away so I could come record it from a distance. And then he called it a freaking knob tip while he was waiting. <laughs> it was little, like 117 or something, but I was like, man... I, I don't know if we knew the super rare gallery existed. Had he dropped them side by side, we could have had a super rare there. I can't remember. And then the Mela itself was 160 something. It was close to super rare on its own. I've been having a good time with the bottom boy. I, I don't know that I can continue to come up with like different specialty hunt ideas, but it's definitely something I want to incorporate more. When I have the, the time to do it, like, you know, once turkey season starts, I'll, I'll certainly have to slow down on it. But, you know, I don't mind sitting there... What, what was the one? The revolver challenge. I think that I sat there for five hours in total recording that, like in little pieces. That was... Like, that was one of the most fun things I've done in a while. And I'm not recording nonstop. Like, I, I just... What, a typical video I record. I press record, spend three hours, however long, recording the entire time. Because that way, you know, I, I record reactions to spot and stuff, all that kind of thing. With the little challenges and stuff, I can record it in pieces. And it's a little more chill, like, you know, sit back and wait till I find something. As opposed to, I just feel like I'm more... Oh, that was back. I'm more on edge, I guess. I gotta do Old Man Flantro for three more minutes now. I guarantee that was intestines. And then good today, a troll goose. We've been April Fools by Call of the Wild itself. Yeah, it's a nice one, Ribbit. 196, 197 is about as big as they get. First diamond moose of the grind. There you go. Yeah, it's not vitals. Might as well start it now. Got three minutes left in the stream. Yeah, I guess about the time the stream ends, it'll be time for my five o'clock nap. Oh, right in the stomach. Boy, I used to be a better shot than that, I'll tell you what. Ah, back in my day, I was an elite deer hunter. People would come from miles around just to see I could shoot through the same bullet hole with open sights at uh, 500 yards. And the stream and your voice. I'll probably use my normal voice to end the stream, but we'll see. Any Tickaboo and Plains content coming? I haven't been to the moon. I don't know if... I don't know if I can do that. I'm headed out for trout this weekend. Let me tell you something. All these people out there trout fishing shoulder to shoulder Casting over your line, fishing in the same fishing hole that you found first. Boy, it just, it rubs me the wrong way. I, I'd rather sleep in. I'll go fishing later. Thank you for reminding who. What? Hey, there's a moose. You go nowhere, buddy. That's it. Off to the long sleep you go. I tell you what. Maybe your next beat, David, can be 100%. I'm getting pretty old. I used to be a young whippersnapper. What's that? Is that a turkey? I can't see that far on nearsighted. And yet I gotta take my glasses off to read. I don't understand how that works. Map name? Uh, Yukon Cornelius. Sounded like old man Hank Hill. Hey, I invented that. He's, they ripped me off. They didn't give me a cent. I worked for my living. 23 seconds. Oh boy. Schust! 
But in tarnation is a shoost. These kids can't spell. They don't have spelling classes anymore. I think they teach them how to send a text message or... Oh, how'd I do that? <laughs> oh man, still got it. No, this is Patrick. Oh, I'm really losing my voice. <laughs> I felt it not happen. Didn't know Biden play Call of the Wild? That's a fact. Play Wayland Hunter Ticketman Planes? We'll see. Now that we uh now that we've gotten all the things on Transylvania, we're not chasing a rare anymore. We got our Mellow Moose off Aurora Shores. Did I have anything else? Oh, there's that albino bison on Aurora Shores. I gotta go back for that eventually. But we might do some Tickamoon before we uh, commit to aging that. I'm pretty sure that Mellow Bison's like big, sad, low percentage like our red deer. <laughs> A lot of walking in that one fall. Well, I'm still a bit of a sprite. Whoa! My hip! My hip! How's that? Flinter's dreams in 50 years. Yeah, welcome back to the Hunter Classic. I still haven't gotten a 400 Rosie for my lodge. I think today's the day. Getting so darn old, I don't got nothing to do but play classic all day. Yeah, welcome to a 12 hour stream. I'll take a nap in the middle, but other than that, that's better. <laughs> all right, double along that one. We'll we end up three hour stream, two hours and 45 minutes because of my own bad, 15 minutes because we could. Dang it, I'm not even shooting at that. But yeah, that was fun. Um, I'm gonna go and try to record some Blocktail for the uh, classic event for tomorrow's video. Looking forward to that. And depending on how things go, depending on how much time I gotta spend potentially finishing that video tomorrow, there may or may not be an English stream in the evening. We'll, we'll see. I don't want to commit to that. I got some stuff to do uh, other than just video related things. Gotta start to prep for Kentucky and all that. So if there's time, there may be a stream tomorrow in the Angler. We shall see. But anyway. That is going to do it for this stream. As always, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you in that classic video tomorrow. Bye!